Lakers TV, man. It is your boy, Shard. It's man. cool, boy, G. Hey, man, two cup in the building. It's your guy, Saddam Osama. <laughs> Saddam Osama, <laughs> man. That's what you If you watching, man, hit the subscribe button. Y'all already know what to do. Follow us. It's free. You know what I'm saying? Um, shout out to our guests who came last week, man. I ain't even going to say your name. Appreciate you, though. We appreciate you, though. We're going to keep it just like that. Much love. You know what I'm saying? Uh, also, uh, if you watch a revolt, watch, you know, subscribe to us. If you truck drivers, you know what I'm saying, whatever, subscribe. You know what I'm saying? Listen, put your earbuds in. You know what I'm saying? I know y'all got the new uh, uh, Apple uh, AirPods in your ear. You know what I'm saying? They just came out with a motherfucking. Going to get me a pair Friday. You know what I'm saying? Other than that, everybody's in here. The whole gang's in yes, here. Yes, sir. You know what I'm saying? But you, but you done credit that motherfucker already, bro? Oh, yeah, but man, just keep told that motherfucker down, <laughs> bro. <laughs> Yeah, stand a chance. Yeah, stand, stand a chance, man. Other than that, man, let's get into it, man. They already know, man, what the game doing. What y'all think about this? Man, what y'all think about Shannon Sharp's sex tape, man? What, what sex volume? Hey, bro. I think, oh. it, I think it was playing, and I think Unk trying to cover something, man. I think he's trying to man, prove, I, I think he trying to prove fucking, to the, I think he's trying to prove to the world that goddamn he fuck women and not men. But I don't give a damn. I still think something funny about that nigga. You can't accidentally hit live. Hire your crew automatically in there to turn it off for you. Bro, just listen to the whole story. It's some bullshit. Now, I'm glad he went ahead and said that, it, that, that you know, it was him. That's the only truth that he told to it, but he ain't tell the whole truth. It, 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 it's some shit that that whole little... Something ain't right about it this time. I fuck with him, but something ain't right about it this time. I just think Uncle fucking, man. I mean, I don't, I don't but know. Who, who, who is in the room to stop it? He said they called him, didn't he? Oh, shit. No. You can have an administrator on your Instagram account. You can have more and more personal Instagram. Oh, they shut it down that way. Gotcha. I'll see what you're saying. Yeah. I, I just think Aunt um, um, was fucking, man. Aunt um, was doing him, and he accidentally clicked us. I, I, I mean, me personally, I just don't think it, it was no deep conspiracy or down. I just think Aunt um, um, was getting one in. But hold up. It's, it's, it's another guy that don't came out right now. Now, I don't know if this is true or not. Allegedly, it's another guy that don't came out calling Shannon Shaw up. I don't hear shit talking some, uh, I'm just going to wait. He said something like, I'm just going to, I forgot what uh, social media page was on. He was like, I'm going to wait to say what it is. Because I guess when he seen it, he was like, oh, like some gay guy don't came out trying to, trying to come at Aunt right now about some shit. He's like, oh, okay. He said, I'm going to wait, though, to say what I got to say. So, you know. We're going to see if it's more to the story. I, I don't think anything. <laughs> you know what I do? What? I'm, I'm going right to ask a man a question right here. Mm -hmm. Who picked your clothes out? Me. Who picked your clothes out? Me. Who picked your clothes? You do? I, I picked mine out. You think you know how to dress? You think you, you uh, pretty good at what you picking out? When I choose to, yeah. Mm. When I choose to, yeah. Why is a grown ass man? First of all, hold on, hold on. Let fuck that. Mm-hmm. Why would you, mm -hmm. knowing you was a professional ex football player, mm -hmm. go get the 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 dude who was dressing up another football player, mm -hmm. laying all in the bed with football player, football player just as big as your ass is. Matter of fact, mm -hmm. and you go get this fool, and then all of a sudden now you want to. Fire this motherfucker. First of all, you a grown ass man. You send no other guy down, especially no man like that, be picking out your heterosexual ass clothes. Okay. That, that, we're going to start right there. Okay. You, you know what Paulie said that? on here that made a lot of sense? What? When he was talking about 21. Mm -hmm. And he was like, that the only nigga that done got up that far and ain't started doing that weird shit. But what do Skeet always come on here and say? What? That shit is not sauce. That shit look freaky and weird when these niggas be putting on all these. Crazy ass designer Like It's it's certain shit you can wear And it's certain shit Like come on bro What are you trying to prove mm -hmm. Like you don't let a punk dress you Like Come on bro Like nigga Unk you bi That's all I'm saying You might be bi That's all I'm saying I ain't saying Unk ain't smashing them home <laughs> But he might be smashing <laughs> Wait a minute Wait a minute, wait a minute. I'm, I'm uh, glad you broke that down See, That's my whole thing hey, Look look right look I'm gonna I'm say this straight up You, you wanna go cut for her you wanna... I, I just, So y'all saying the man Gay okay, That's what y'all saying fuck, No no fuck. no I said He's <laughs> Oh, I don't know. Home, I man. don't think, think, I think, I think I'm just I think, laying the evidence out there. I just think he did some shit. I don't think that anything. he's taking that he's been taking since he's been elevating. And hey, niggas can say what the fuck they want to say. I don't give a fuck how much money you got. Somebody got down, put some shit out here about your ass, especially uh, 
uh, questioning your sexuality, it's gonna bother you. You can say what the fuck you want to say, but it's gonna bother you. All right. right now, if anybody say, say it right it. now, got if kids. any three of y'all niggas, if right now somebody bro. say, hey, cook, I heard nigga cook, goddamn, gay as a motherfucker, bro, you gonna defend yourself. You gonna clarify some shit. He, yeah, he been defending himself. He's been defending himself. I'm, 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 yeah, I'm defending defend myself, of course. So what you saying, he ain't defending himself? No, what I'm saying is, like I said at the beginning, I feel like there's some shit he did on fucking purpose. No, 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 I don't think it's on purpose. Hold on, let me rewind <laughs> that. Okay, I don't want you to think I'm saying. Him going live is on. on right, like I, he did be, that. I, I think both of y'all are wild. But no, 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 no. I, I, let, let me tell you about the live now. Okay, what I think about the live is I think he was in that, he was in that crushing Tatum one of them got no white holes up through there. Mm-hmm. Like he, he went straight power town on. Mm-hmm. And his phone happened to just go off. Now, the reason I say about all the, the, the other shit is because the punk done went out there and said, oh, uh, like the punk's mad because he, he and Shannon Hindi he got them hoes too. Like, nigga, you knew this nigga wasn't. Like, come on. That's what I'm saying. That's like, and I'm not saying the nigga like, oh, I, the punk is trying to make it seem like unk okay. gay. Mm-hmm. I'm not saying unk okay, gay. Unk was just smashing the hoe. Mm-hmm. So it might, you know what I'm saying? I don't think that shit with no ass. Do you, do you think walk gay? Walk. Mm-hmm. Like who? Who the hell is walk? Gucci man. You think who, who the hell was like? What you the think fuck? He, I'm just asking you a question. You ask me a question. I ask your question man, straight up. Look, bro, hold on. No, no, no. Hold on. No, no, no. You ask somebody. I, you ask me a question. <laughs> I ask your question straight up. Is he gay? <laughs> fuck no, Gucci man. So why he letting somebody dress him? Nigga, now we can go deep into this now. I'm just well, saying. He let a punk dress him. Nah, 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 nah. Why did Dolph no, 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 wait, 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 no. he, man, he, Listen, nah, Dolph he, 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 he got sorry. a point. It's a lot of punks that dress a lot of celebrities. I think I think y'all letting the internet make y'all look. Look at man, should have been famous a long time. Man did 13 years in the NFL. <laughs> hey, we ain't had Nan Gay Room come out. That's what I just said. So I'm not saying the man gay, but the shit is you, weird. You, you okay. just said he was fucking the hoes with the punk. I said he might. You just said this. No, I said, I said he fucking the hoes for shit. Before you started that, you said, you, before you started that, now, excuse me, we got to call it what it is. Now, you said the nigga, he probably buy. He yeah, buy. You just called the he man. Buy. I said he might be buy. Like, man, stop this shit. I don't man. think he's gay. He's got kids. Well, what happens here, bro? Well, we I don't get... know. You can't say that. It's, niggas married with kids that still gay. What happened there, man? Was, and y'all fall into the trap, too, bro. Once the niggas certain, we reach a certain amount of success, we try to look for a reason to why they got that success, bro. And then we try and then we try to sit up and, and come up with these reasons through the internet why, oh, he must be this or he must be gay. When one of y'all niggas get gay, don't get mad when I call you. When one of y'all niggas get up through that, don't be mad since the folks start calling y'all gay. I mean, we ain't had we ain't had not one inclination a nigga from rural South Georgia that this man was gay. Soon as Cat, they said Cat Williams was gay. Every nigga who gets some money, they say gay. And we and then we our own kind of sit up. The man that told us I'm not gay. He, he what else we supposed to go by? I just said he was smashing the white hoe. No, I'm just saying he 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 went and he he went and got a person who was his fucking stylist. Y'all know Shannon Star, big country ass, can't dress. Right, look, I put it like this. I put it like this. I'll I help you out. Hold, hold, hold Since on. you on Arc Team, get what? Arc Ark there. Arc there. Arc there. Because that little nigga insinuate like Arc is goddamn this, food. I say this. For, forget Arc. Uh, fuck Arc. Uh. I say the same shit about any time we done had conversations about that gay shit about anybody. So let's not make it about Arc uh, now. But I always, I always, said, I always sit up here and say the same shit. We let the internet sit up and try to make us our fucking niggas that's standing on business, our niggas that's coming on the internet, who's who's actually acting the same way that we act and shit like that. We let the internet take them motherfuckers now every single time, and then we jump on the bandwagon with the shit. Oh, that nigga must be gay. The nigga said, and, and obviously, then none of y'all watch his goddamn his his, his, his uh, live tonight. Who's addressing this shit? You think this nigga gonna fuck up a two hundred million dollar deal? I, you mean I, tell me he gonna do that to to, to act? Just to have his phone go off. He's working. They fired Paul Pierce on ESPN yeah, yeah, yeah. for being in the room with some bitches. For some bitches. You think they won't fire Shannon Sharp if he would have did that shit on purpose? I just said it was on What purpose. is we talking about right now? Like, like what kind of logic is this? I didn't say it was we on can go purpose. Gucci Man, we can go Dolph, we can go Fabulous, we can go a lot of niggas, bro. And I know just, just passion right now. Who we can sit up and say, oh, they was be, they was being dressed by somebody this and that. You mean to tell me we put on every designer we put on is gay? Every single one of them, uh, uh, Versace, every, Dior, all the motherfuckers gay. Every single one of them, go pick one. Whatever you don't, and everybody here don't wore it before. Everybody here don't wore it before. Every single person. Oh, and, and I ain't got a gay bone in my body. Okay, that's all, all fine and dandy. But we're talking about the weird shit. We're what not just talking shit? about the label. We're, we're all we're gonna wear is the actual name brand. We're gonna wear the label. Okay, let's brand. speak on the weird. We're shit. not gonna wear. The, the super flamboyant looking ass shit, cause we don't even know where to go to fucking get it. Who? That's I, you know what I mean. Like, in Atlanta, there, Georgia, it's plenty of places. Man, you know what I mean, bro. Like th- th- certain shit, you see these niggas on, you know you're not gonna wear that shit. 
Was Unless it, you what, get up there to that level and they, and they and start telling you one, that shit in your country. And I got one question for you. What do Aunt um, Weather was weird? Because everything he wore, me or you would have put it on. That Louis Vuitton jacket was hard. When I ain't was never really, say nothing. When, uh, when you, said, you said we talking about the weird shit. What weird shit I didn't say he, he dressed weird. I'm talk, we, I'm talk, we talking about Atlanta. So we, we're talking about these Atlanta niggas. No, like, no, no. You talking about Atlanta niggas. You talking about, the question right, was, well, well, oh, the God, only God. weird thing was his ass is sitting beside Buddy. Yes. That, that was the weird thing. And, and the other weird thing is the buddy said, his little two cents, he put it in. Mm -hmm. Aunt need to address that little motherfucker. He fired the nigga because he hired somebody to be his thoughts before him. And he said he felt like he was doing him, doing his original people wrong by hiring somebody else to do that same job. The lady complained about, I've been with you since day one. I was in the car with you when your car broke down on the side of the road. So he let the gay nigga go. He only got the gay nigga when he started elevating so he can look a certain way on TV. Bro, yo, yo, image, Kevin Hart said the best. Your image is every fucking thing. Yes, when you get money, you're going to elevate. Nigga, even when I come on here and do this podcast, nigga, I don't try, even though my shit on the lower level, I got on goddamn just regular, you know what I'm saying? I might throw on a white tee. I don't, I'm not going to come on here just looking crazy. This shit ain't going nowhere. Did, did you see nobody start saying anything about him being gay until Buddy posted that shit? No, I see, no, no, no. I see nobody start saying shit about him being gay until Cat Williams went on there and took his ass to the number one interview in the fucking world. No, I ain't talking about then. I'm talking about, but that shit had died down. After that, what? I'm talking about now. After the little him going live and fucking on the bitch, I'm mm -hmm. talking about now. The only reason folks are saying anything about him being gay, like in these last couple of days, is because the little punk posted. He wrote some shit. That's what I'm saying. I, 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 I didn't know that they no, were no, saying he was, was gay. That, that's, no, what, that's what. That's what I'm talking about. I, I ain't seen. See, well, see, you, you don't even know what I'm talking about right now. That's why I was saying he need to address that little nigga. So you thinking I'm yeah, just calling up the gay from from hell? Cause he made him. the video. No, I didn't think everybody hell, was I that deep about. I him. didn't even think I, that. I, like I said, I just think Uncle was fucking man. Aunt, that's, Aunt, all, that's what I'm saying. I don't, think, I don't think he did, did it on purpose. Cause ain't nobody gonna throw no money away. That's stupid as hell. For one, just to prove the niggas that I'm not gay. I don't think that. But if you go look up the look the the, the other designer or dresser, whatever you it was, the, uh, um, uh, he went on there and he he started saying shit. That's why people are saying, oh, it's it's like it's flim flam because he's trying to say it's flim flam. I'm saying right now the style is just bad. He got fired. Yeah, but I'm saying. I ain't, so I ain't seen nothing about no. He's, well, he, he I'm, just, I'm, I'm looking at it right now. No, I'm on YouTube I, right I, now. No, I seen what he was talking about. That's why I said at the beginning. Somebody yeah. said, like, I'm not just sitting here just, oh, free picking, cuz. No, that's not what I'm doing. That's why I said, cuz. I don't need to address that little nigga and tell him, shut the no, fuck up. I don't up. think he buy. I just, I mean, I don't, I don't, I don't fucking them bitching, man. Well, obviously. I, I I I'm seeing right here that the stylist is just basically saying Shannon Sharp is ascending rapidly in media. It is what it it, it is what it is. Does a lot for for people, and he was being blackballed by talent. Both can be great. That's all I'm saying. I don't know what y'all talking about. Did y'all even read the post from the damn stylist? Cause we on camera right now. What, did y'all even read the post? Or did y'all just see a headline? Which one are we talking about right now? Cause they make headlines say anything. Cause I'm telling you what I'm reading right here. So they said the stylist. I know what he's talking about because I seen it. My, I seen it too. So I, he not he not just making. Did the story of Shannon Sharp and was forced to fire his gay stylist after backlash? It was <laughs> Shannon Sharp says it was it's a whack reason to fire somebody. Stylist speaks out. He ain't saying that the nigga. I don't know. I mean, we just going through real time looking at the shit, but the nigga ain't saying nothing fucking crazy for the one I'm seeing. Nah, what he talking about? It ain't it ain't got nothing to do with the stylist. It's it's a whole nother person. Know what I'm talking about? It's, it's a whole other person. Now look, we just so. started, y'all nigga. Just said his former assistant. You said former assistant, and he said agree with the stylist. Both this stylist was both on. Now which one we talking about now? Because because I, I know I said. I'm just saying we sit up here and, and talking about shit that the internet making us to be, they're making us to believe, man. I, look, I can't do them but take a man. Look at me. I don't give a fuck what that nigga do in his bedroom. That's up to him. But I can't sit up here and just say, like, bro, we gotta guard our treasures, man. We I gotta guard our like man. we we is wilding right now, bro. We wilding. Like we is tripping right now, like we we like so we just anytime they come out. So it, it, this is one thing I do know: anytime any black man start getting to some major money, the gay room will come flying. Yeah, the gay room will come flying. We quit to call them gay. Every time some black man, bro, but y'all niggas ain't said this nigga was zesty until two thousand twenty three. we seen Shannon Shaw play something from nineteen ninety to two thousand one. Ain't y'all ain't heard now one of y'all niggas said nigga was zesty out there making them touch now. Dang. Greg, show me a time when you say, "Boy, that nigga that gotta be gay out there, boy." Ain't none of y'all. Ain't one of y'all done said nothing about this. I ain't called none of these niggas gay. I didn't. I didn't. I didn't start the charge. 
Exactly. I, 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 I just started agree. the game. I, and I agree. And I don't sit there and campaign. Ark is gay. That's not what I'm doing. You ask the question. If you don't ask the question, you ain't going to get that. But you said he would buy. But you still think he buy. You said he would buy. I said, I said, I, bro, hey, man. Motherfucker, you said he would buy. Hey, you said he would buy. I'm just using your words. What you said? What that look like to you? What that look like? All right, then, shut the fuck up. Let me see. No, it's just, it's just a picture. But what I'm saying is, <laughs> hey man, you just said the same. But no, but 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 how does that look to you? So they quit acting like y'all ain't human, like y'all like shit, nigga. We all. But in. I did not come up. Hold on, let's let's start off by this. Okay. I didn't come up with aunt was gay. That I didn't start the campaign for aunt to be mm -hmm. gay. Unless I didn't come up with this goddamn question but about. You read aunt it enough. But, but no, no, no. But it. if you ask a question, don't get mad at the answer. I'm not mad at the answer. That's, that's what we here for. Why did you get the answer? By reading them articles like no, that. No, I didn't read shit. I just looked at this motherfucker. We, we, look, we yeah, here. We so, are we are here to debate the topic. That's all we're doing. All I'm saying is that nigga, what the fuck are we talking about with somebody who we have not seen these type of typical situations for? So you can't hide nobody gay. Not so so if you got a business, can't nobody here hide nobody gay. Man, that nigga Greg must be gay hiding that fact. No, that nigga do his job fucking well. <laughs> The fuck? <laughs> nigga, we work with gay motherfuckers every day. Nigga, you got homeboys and homegirls who's gay. Okay. Call them out. Let's call yeah. them out. He the motherfucking gay. It is what it is. But y'all sitting up here pre picking this man because he got a gay stylist. Cause, or he dressing this nigga. Y'all nigga drinking for the same bottle and shit. Talking about some, this, my gay partner. We just having us a bill right now. Man, come on, man. We can't do that, Skeet, man. That's all I'm saying. I'm just saying the internet make us feel like it's just the internet, bro. It ain't saying it's you. I'm not saying it's Greg. Bro, come on, bro. We, we, we ain't seen. Look, most of the motherfuckers when we was growing up, we seen they was gay from the, from the jump, bro. We seen this shit that they was gay or we seen some zesty shit that they was gay. The same way we won't call Young Thug out for wearing dresses, we try to overlook that shit like a motherfucker now. Man, that nigga, y'all know Thug. No, nigga, that shit was zesty, nigga. You know what I'm saying? It, it just what it was. Whoever Shout said out to it Thug. was. Whoever Shout out to Thug. It was. With you. I'm not saying that. I'm not. But they, I'm, but not, but I'm but just saying that, in ain't general. Ain't how him and uh, rest in peace, Rich Homie Corn. But ain't that how him and Corn fell out? No, Korn? they fell out because some street shit. Because Corn got down was being. Uh, it, it, I ain't gonna go into that. Right. Nah, let go back. No, the, no, we still stuck on Unk though. First of all, I, I got down right. I'm gonna stand on. I don't need no guy. No, I don't need that man. That type of man dressing me. That, that's how I feel. Okay. Now that's for me. I feel. And I, I think I can pick my own. But we got. But, but I agree. But I'm, I'm saying. But it. I, yes, I. Everybody, nigga, you can't get away from uh, every. It's, it's in the world. We're in the world. Mm -hmm. So yeah, you're gonna be around gay people. All, all that type shit. But do people? Do but guess what? Unk is the one getting accused of being gay. So that that's what just that, they're accusing him, and then they're trying to put out their evidence. I, I'm sorry that some of the evidence looks weird. So you, said, so you, so you okay. said either I mean you saying you don't you don't have no problem with Dylan I mean you ain't got no trust because it's, it's gay. Because I, I, I got I got gay. gay, 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 gay. gay. If you was to get on the movie and and they had some makeup artist come to you and do your face before the movie starts. That thing about if you do it, a movie, but you, but you, you gotta said, put on makeup. But you just said you wouldn't personally hire somebody to work for you who's gay. Is nah, no, 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 no. I'm saying, nigga, I won't hire no straight nigga to come pick my clothes. Like, nigga, I know how to pick on my own shit. Nah, that ain't what I'm asking. I'm, I'm saying, would you hire? He said that's for him though. Okay. That, he said that's how he feel about it. Yeah, I, ain't, I ain't gonna argue. That's what I'm saying. I will pick out my own fucking clothes. I don't need no nigga to tell me, ooh, but you need to put them. Jet. No, nigga, I. Nigga, I I ain't blind. I, I can see. But I agree with you on that. But do that. But that. Do, okay, that's you though, right? We just. I'm just talking. Uh, bro, well, I, I feel like that. Okay, I give you a better example. Mm -hmm. He said he fired that motherfucker because got down. He, he felt like he did shout the wrong who was working with him at first. Right. But you. But that shit only happened when you was at that Laker game and motherfucker seen you sitting beside that motherfucker. So everybody picking at you about being gay for hiring, having that motherfucker right there. Then you fired that nigga. So you making it look like. Nigga, you gay. My bad. Yeah, but that's, that's, but that's what that shit is. Like, for that's real, true. nigga. That's true. It ain't like I, I didn't never look at it like that. Nigga, you didn't find that nigga. You didn't feel like that before that? Uh, He hired him in 2020. Nobody said nothing in 2023. Yeah, I, did, I, did nobody I, see that nigga sitting courtside at the liquor game? It, it, it doesn't matter. He's been getting in and out of cars with him since forever. Bro. But that, when that shit got done put until, on black? Until, I'm telling you when I saw it. Until, so she and then once that, I saw it, that's when he got his ass up out of there. So you telling me in Hollywood, you don't think nobody else got a gay stylist dressing up? I ain't say that. I'm saying, oh, I think so so when right it's fashion, it's definitely more gay people that run their fashion stuff. Man, we know they run this shit, man. Like, like, like we ain't gonna act, act crazy about this shit. That's who run this shit. But what I'm saying is, once Unk got spotted out for whatever Unk did or whatever happened, he got spotted. Simmons, gay or not, you fired that motherfucker right after that. 
Okay. And that's what. The, and guess what? Everybody that's making them click links. That's what they want. The more you read it somewhere, the more you're gonna believe it. The more you see it, the more. Yeah, that's that, but that goes back. That, that goes back I to Sean's point that, can... that we let in the media yeah, control that's what we're doing. I understand propaganda, but you got to understand. But if that, that like, is what happened though. But if he was hired in 2020, why y'all didn't feel not, like not, not saying that you're gay or nothing. Get what? Oh, you should have you kept both of their ass in. Okay. Because so you made it look even worse by firing the motherfucker. Okay, so let me ask y'all a question. Y'all think. So you know, they don't make it look worse? Y'all. I'm going to let y'all cook until I get I'm just saying. Also, oh, let me ask one question. Do, do y'all think Diddy gay? <laughs> Answer that. I do. Because you want to sit there and watch niggas. Why? Because his, his allegations been with women. No, oh, yeah. But now, no, no, it's some men that don't say something, but they ain't proved nothing. It just been. A rumor, hey, hey, but 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 everybody want to say no, did he? Everybody want to be on him. Hell, so he Obama's on him too much. So he ain't no no. So so Diddy, no so, so, so so Diddy can be gay because of rumors, but Shannon Shaw can't be. I, I never said. Diddy I ain't saying gay. that one of them gay. I'm just saying. I'm just saying if if y'all saying you can't get into what people saying and fall into that trap, then why we why everybody fell into the trap of Diddy being gay? Because Diddy's name is in fucking paperwork. It's documented, bro. Shannon Sharp ain't in no paperwork. Go look at this no, shit. No, okay, no, no, and Skeet, no, no, I already know no, no, Skeet no, no. knew that was coming. No, let me ask you a question. No, 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 Remember, she came out first and said, you know what I'm talking about. This nigga beat me up at this hotel Tell on me. this day and did this and that. Everybody like, she lying. Yeah, lying. The it actual, on. when the footage came out, the date, you know, when you do uh, see yeah. clothes time caption. Stamp. You know, the time, time stamp was in the actual corner of that at the same exact time and everything, which Diddy thought he had bought it. After that, the nigga Lil Rod started talking about what Diddy was doing with motherfuckers and all type of shit. Nigga, a nigga just won a settlement for 100 million million saying million, that him and that. Diddy was fucking... He didn't win. They, 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 he did win. He won. I, did he file an emergency won. emotion to, to, because he didn't show up to court? The nigga won. Oh, shit. Yeah, I this is documented. I didn't know that. I didn't know, that. I didn't know about that. Look, I'm not devil a nigga no, fucking. I ain't know nothing about I'm not that, devil a nigga fucking nobody, yeah. but it's a whole bunch of, it's a whole paper trail this nigga being with niggas. It's it, it, it what it is. He told Fabulous them in a fucking, in, in, on Drink Champs, you know, I like it when you, when you, when you wiggle them shake like that, daddy. It's factual. Damn. Yeah, no, 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 no. Let's go to play this on the camera. Let's go to play this on, 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 on the podcast. Because, cause, like, we got to start goddamn, like, nigga, I done did the research on this shit. It's a whole bunch, a whole heap of paperwork. Show me some paperwork, paperwork right now with Shannon Sharp gay. Okay. I'll wait. Man, only thing they got, on, on, people start calling Shannon Sharp gay and looking at that shit. When he got out, they calling that little olive jumpsuit. That's and they it. were like, hitting the look, 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 And shit look, like that. Now, and then folks started digging back. And the, man, the look, man that system been out. Nigga, I ain't even put it all the way in. Nigga, I ain't even put it all the way in. Look, read that at the top. What I put in? Did he what? Comes on the file. I look. But, no, what? No, 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 it out. No, I, we, we gonna get right back to the. We getting off. Uh, but this, Diddy, this we know what Diddy got this going on. Great, Diddy, dirty, dirty dollars, man. We ain't stunned him. Got down, but all <laughs> ass. Okay, <laughs> all <laughs> up had to do yeah. when they took that damn picture. Don't fire the nigga, cause that he literally fired that nigga after that picture shit. Like. That's my the own picture. Oh, not saying oh, I'm not saying he gay, but that's still. You, saying, you say he fired him after the picture hit the fan. Yeah, yeah, because like, like the picture had been took. But yeah. what I'm saying, once it hit the fan, that's a bad thing. Okay. Like you, you ain't even if you're not gay. Like when I'm not saying aren't uh, gay. That's a bad look. Hold on, bro. Bro. hold on, Skeet. Hold on now. Now if I go out here and hire somebody gay to dress me, right, and then all y'all niggas start picking at me, bro, I'm fine. But guess what though, you should know better. No, and I don't know better. I'm yeah, just you, saying. I'm just tell you. Also, oh, also, way older no. than us. He probably really slick. Don't know no better. But you know better, bro. The nigga is working. Nah, you know oh, 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 I, listen, what I'm saying. The nigga is working in Hollywood, bro. He ain't even thinking like that's a big deal. Like, 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 like bro. Like, I can't. So that's that, why I said Unk's older. But obviously, he self consciously he cares what motherfuckers think. I'm not because he went in fire. I, 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 look, one thing I'm not arguing is the fact that I agree with you on not argument debate. Like, I, I agree with you. It ain't even debating if you get him. It ain't even about him being gay. I, I, don't, I don't even care about the cop. Obviously, one thing I can verify he's fucking these hoes. Like he's he's in there hanging off with one. Mm -hmm. But 
Nigga, that, like, why did you fire the motherfucker? Like, it, it, fuck being gay. The gay motherfuckers just be mad that he, he did they ass like that. Yeah. Yeah, I, I, just, I just look at it. I, I get what you're saying. So y'all I, I, saying I, I don't get it. Y'all saying oh, wrong for having a gay assistant. I ain't saying he no, doesn't no, have I, a gay assistant. No, no, that wasn't no assistant. That's a style. No celebrities no, got a gay No, quit trying to know what the motherfucker is. Okay, the motherfucker stylish. is yeah. a stylist. Yeah. I, you damn right. I think it's wrong. Like, nigga, you don't need no motherfucking dress. You, you old head. What the fuck you, are you about to put on? Like, for real. You're rich. It don't even matter. But I don't All think he's looking at it like this nigga gay. Nah, I ain't even talking about that. Okay, so what if it wasn't a style if it was a chef? I put it like What that. you gonna say? He dead ass wrong, but you have a gay nigga cooking your food. You, you a grown man. You cook your own goddamn food. Yeah, but, but, like, like, Look, like, you wait. If you're not gay and you're comfortable with yourself, what's the purpose of fine, bro? So now, now you want him to keep him to prove he ain't gay. Because if you ain't gay, if you ain't gay, what the way? Hey, no, I ain't going to do that. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. No, no, whoa, whoa. I don't want to do shit. Y'all asking the question. I'm just, I'm just giving you other shit, other way to look at it. But I'm saying there was no way for Aunt to win. Yeah, that's what I'm, that's all I'm trying. That's the best way for me to do. Okay, okay, no way for Aunt to win. win. Oh, okay, what? Hey, I can, so I can go for that. But don't act like what I'm saying don't make sense too, though. But there's you only two fire options: fire him or don't fire him. Okay. So, so which it, one was the better option then? Fire his ass. At least he ain't him no more. Like, like, like I said, it, it, it just be little stuff that be throwing me off about Aunt. Sometimes you got this. This big ass man walking around with this small ass purse with a little puppy in it. Do do do, come on, do do Like, goddamn, ooh, ooh, I got God something to build a white dish. Wow, no, nigga, niggas can't have nothing. Look, dog, nigga, white dish, white dish. How many niggas walk around with a little puppy in a purse? Now look, now fuck, fuck, we off, fuck, we off, fuck, we off, fuck, y'all hell, man. Oh, I, I mean, look, we all, uh, uh, I fall nigga, yeah, I so can't even. I, I ain't gonna lie to you, bro. I can't even go. I mean, I had a cat, bro. So I can't even. I seen Eminem with a cat. But was you carrying that cat in a little bitty purse on your waist? Every nigga, day. a cat ain't gonna let man, you carry him anyway. Niggas weren't even thinking about shit like that, man. But no, no, watch it. I got an even better one for you. Okay, Unc is completely straight. We're gonna, we gonna say Unc straight. We move him out the way. No, you already called him by. No, no, no. <laughs> fuck that. Unc straight. Hold on. No, fuck that. Come to point. Yeah, I'm gonna point. All right, go ahead. Without, if you didn't know, because we didn't have paperwork, mm -hmm. would you have believed Dwight Howard was gay? Yeah. Without the paperwork. Without seeing those videos of him grabbing oh, dick on the yeah. sideline and shit. There we go. Would you believe that nigga was gay? Tell the truth now. Yeah, I thought. I, I, why though? Why? Why? What did he do that was gay? Besides, you seen them videos of him grabbing folk dick on the bed. <laughs> you can't <laughs> use that. You can't use that. If you but can't we, use that, what, what made him gay? What made you think he was gay? No, no. Okay, so with Dwight Howard, I didn't. I never argued that fact with him being gay. I'm only arguing the fact that we don't have documentation of um. No, 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 no. I, I ain't. But I'm just saying. What I said. That's what I said. Imagine. What I'm saying is, y'all paint a picture that anybody can be gay. I ain't gonna let y'all do that because, because that's the case. All of us up here gay. No, I'm just no. I man, nigga, that nigga cut. That nigga cut wear cocks every week, man. No, I'm just saying. No, no, but you get what I'm saying. Man, nigga cut wear cocks every week, man. But look, but no, I can't let y'all do that, bro. That shit wild, bro. That shit wild as fuck, bro. Nah, bro, because they can say that about anybody. Like, like, no, I, bro, I'm not calling no. First of all, it's a couple times I'm not calling no nigga unless I'm in private. and I'm just talking shit. Gay, pedophile, and motherfucking the snitch. Period. That's why I said I'm not calling. But we got paperwork on the watch. Yeah. So you know, that's why I said that's why I could use him for an example. I wouldn't use nobody that we don't like. You, you know what I'm saying? You done put um in the power range of committed man. Nah, nah, nah. <laughs> he, he according to Yuski, he has to put the privacy around you the, the same beat. Same question. And them hold them 13 yeah. years in the NFL. Put nine Pro Bowls. Nah, what the fuck it was? Y'all can't see the name. No, man, shit. That car. Oh, might take no glass off. I just seen a video. Unk was in the gym, but he had yeah. 88 kilograms on each side. Man, that's why I say, say on, the, on the warm up of the shoulders. Man. <laughs> like saying, that, ain't, that ain't Gavante Davis. I, I, exactly. I don't want those problems. That's why I said Unk. I just think, man, we can't, yeah. we can't sit up, but, but we can't sit up and act like certain shit. Like, I don't agree with the puppet shit, bro. Like, I'm going to be real with you, man. Like, by, you know, like, like, I can't agree with that. I can't agree with just because a nigga wear a pouch or a nigga wear certain clothes and shit like that. Like, come on, man. Little baby got, he got his finger in there painting, man. No, Y'all ain't holding none of these niggas to their standard, bro. Baby, baby say he ain't, ain't getting anything in there, pain. I know he's what he said, but we know what we saw. 
Hey, man. I've been saying club salt. and dress. I, I, I call know, that weird shit and dress. Like, like, it's a whole bunch of niggas. A whole bunch of niggas in Atlanta, but y'all be letting slide like a motherfucker, man. Shit, but but because this nigga, but because this nigga, fifty six years old, you know he ain't gonna get out there with them two bad hips, boy. We we just letting shit, gay fly. The way he get the hell if he came with them on like that, he grabbed you. That's your ass. Yeah, I'm just saying, bro. Like we can't, bro. I, I I'm being completely honest, bro. Like the internet making niggas think whatever, bro. Nobody yeah. saying nothing to a cat, bro. Yeah, it's called a rabbit hole. Nobody said nothing. That's, to that's the definitely cat. y'all are in it too, boy. All the year, <laughs> y'all are deep too, boy. But y'all, y'all on page y'all three deep. in the rabbit hole, y'all boy. Deep, boy. Y'all on y'all third video. Y'all deep. Boy. Boy, boy. And I'm, not, saying, I'm, saying, I'm saying another reason why I know the White House was gay because he got on the podcast, but asked me, he didn't answer the question. Oh, see, I don't know. I ain't know he did all. You know what I'm saying? Like, but no, I, I'm saying. I didn't even go delve that deep, and I don't care if Unks got down fruity or not. I didn't care that he was actually against some pussy. I don't give a fuck what the fuck Unk does. Now, but when I see some shit, I can have my opinion because it's what an asshole, That's what and we everyone have, has one. That's what we now, my opinion is that I can put my own goddamn clothes on. I don't want one. Of them. I don't need nobody dressing me because I don't want to start dressing weird. And we all say once these niggas get to a certain level, they start do dressing weird. And that goes for all these niggas. It ain't just um, it's a lot. It's all these niggas. You got to. And, pop, as soon, gotta and pop, guess man. what? As soon as one nigga get mad at another nigga, they're gonna call them gay. And then they're gonna give you all these little tidbits to make you think the niggas gay. Do you think he but guess what? Uh-huh. And, 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 and for niggas sit there and watch it enough, you can you can eventually you know, like oh, shit. Why you doing that? You might be gay. Huh? You call that man Bible, man. That's why I, I said rabbit hole. Listen, I, I'm explaining to you how this shit happened. Okay. So you no, 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 the for right here. Little baby in the sandwich with Kyle Kuzman and the other dude at the uh, all white party. Uh, uh, now, yeah. if you keep showing me enough pictures, oh, I seen a picture of the dude touching little baby ass at the, they in backstage before a concert or something. Dude had his hand right by little baby. At, like, it, okay, so now if I start thinking little baby gay, and I done seen all that, but I don't got no actual proof. I'm just, but I'm fucking seen. I get you on that. You know what I'm saying? But that's rabbit the hole. more shit. Yeah, the rabbit hole. Yeah. Like you can't get mad at a motherfucker going down the rabbit hole. Don't put shit in the hole for him to see. So let me ask you a question: Would you have thought the same thing if he had a female stylist and was still dressing the same? No, cause what the fuck, nigga? That's not, bro. Let me, I, I'm sorry, man. I, America, listen. All right, look. Hold on. So you got I gotta put this claim right. This has nothing to do with women dressing men. No, nah, cause see, I see what y'all trying to do. Y'all trying to throw that no, shit. Hey, out. I'm just saying. Like, I'm I'm I got the start. Nigga, I started. Uh, I started like with you. I said I thought the shit was. No, I'm gonna be. I'm with you for a minute. But y'all don't want to just say what I'm saying. This is what I'm saying. This is what I'm saying. This is what I'm saying. What's, look, you know what? They want to be treated regular. We talk about regular <laughs> niggas all day. We, we don't. We sit there. I, I give all these regular niggas the blue. Call them all types of shit. I sat there and said, Yadi can't dress. I said, I want to fight Javante David. Now, once I go to start talking about these others, motherfuckers want to get in their feelings. No, nigga, I'm treating everybody accordingly because that's what the fuck they say. Okay, okay. Ain't nobody getting cut no slack, bro. I don't Every- even call them <laughs> No, he probably don't. <laughs> but what I'm saying is, get what? Get what I'm going to do, though. Aunt sit on, on the goddamn club, say, say, and argue about these bitches all day long. Yeah, that's true. Mm-hmm. But shit, that's some whole ass shit. But I'm not saying you a whole aunt. I'm just saying that's some whole ass. But yeah, like you, you no, no, no. Guy. I said that is some whole ass shit. I'm not saying he's a hoe. Cause why you call him by? Why did I call him by? Because he had that thing sitting by him. <laughs> now, there, you go. Hill, that's a good one. there like you go. That's why. That's good one. Now, I'm, I'm gonna say this though. I don't. I, I, I want this to be completely. Like, I ain't never seen Aunt dress weird to me. I feel like he dressed his fucking age. I ain't never seen him dress weird. Like, I, look at that straight. Like, just because, just because the style, he had a gay style. Yeah, what? That gay style was putting that shit on him for his age. No, watch this. Like, that made sense to this me. This even better. We didn't give a fuck who was dressing on. We never even thought about who was dressing up until he set his ass over there on the sideline and tried to buck on John Morant and had that thing sitting beside him. That's when this shit hit the fan. I'm about to bleep out thing. <laughs> <laughs> but, but that's true though. He had, had cut on. Uh, he had a little homie. He had his little homie <laughs> yeah. sitting right there beside him yeah. when he was showing his ass and wanted to whip the whole grizzly. Yeah, yeah okay. So yeah. supposed to buy him a different seat or something? No. <laughs> God damn, Skeet. No, I ain't saying that. I'm saying, to. don't he look. You know what? We just talked about actions and reactions. You can't. You, I can't act up and get mad at how we react to it when we see the whole the whole film. Yeah, 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 yeah wait. You want to you want to? I don't always say you don't know who he's dating because he keeps that on the route. They know they got to deal with him. But get what? Aunt was acting like that at the game. 
Now you know what? I'm 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 agree with you this time, Ski, because I'm mm. I'm I'm gonna say this. Look, I'm trying to bro, what, what no, the fuck no, you doing saying. going to the NBA game and you trying to fight the damn player? They say it's on the hell. Nigga, you're a fan. Nigga, sit your ass the fuck down. But you know what, though? <laughs> yeah, he did. He, he was wrong, wrong for that, though. You know what, he was wrong for that. He was wrong for I'm, that. I'm glad you made it. Right yeah, yeah, he, he was wrong and for that. He said he was wrong for that. And where did the picture come from? The Lakers. He, he apologized. Oh, you that, know what, though, Skeet? You got it. No, I'm not saying But don't get mad at how we react when we when we get the full scope of what's going on. No, listen, I'm agreeing with you. No, 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 listen, listen. I'm agreeing with you. You actually got a point. It makes sense. It's like, first of all, okay, if it's your stylist, it's your stylist, but. Why is your stylist with you at a basketball game? That means obviously y'all don't develop some type of friendship, which is go back to the question. He said, why did you fire your friend? Because I don't know too many people that take their style. They may take their stylists with them on the road while they doing stuff. But to just be in the event with, with, with the person they styling for, that's, I mean, you don't see that too often. It's like, why was he even at the game with him? He could have been somewhere else. I mean, who, who takes pictures with their stylist? Like, if, if your style is a female, why would they be like, oh... No, I don't see people with take his, pictures with no, their stylists. I'm just saying, why, why, why was he even at the game? But did you know that with their stylists? Like, if it was set, like, I don't like, like, it'd be some, like, fashion show. They yeah, like, but we're not paying attention yeah. to their stylists. Nobody, the only reason not, why we're paying attention to Shane and Shaw's style because he gay. Why then? No, no, no. You want to tell you why we, why we paying attention to it? Because they was at a game together. I know all these niggas yep. getting dressed by somebody fruity, bro. We can look and tell. Mm -hmm. It's understood. That's what runs Hollywood. That's what runs this shit. Like, we understand that. We know, like, what's going on. Nobody knew but Shannon we Shaw. haven't seen nobody hanging out nobody with him knew, like that. Nobody knew Shannon Shaw being dressed by nobody gay. Because the reason... No, I ain't saying that we did. He did not Because he did not look like he was being dressed but, by somebody gay. But I was gay. saying nine times out of ten. That we, we know what's going... We, we, like, we see. Like, we understand. Like, that's well, who's dressing niggas. It ain't about him that being his yeah, style. It ain't about... Up, 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 the the problem up. was, he showed his ass at the Laker game. And the niggas put him on blast for sending over there with Cuzzo. Yeah, because that's what we do. That's us, bro. All I'm, all, I, look, bro, I'm not saying, but I've been sitting here quiet because I know what you're saying makes sense. I'm not saying what you're saying don't make sense. What I'm saying is that society make it seem like, oh, as soon as, bro, as soon as we get some money, it's a problem. I just sat up here and told y'all, what, about 10 minutes ago, a nigga been in the South since 2021, bro. Nobody said nothing. I'm ready for them. I'm in the loom. Nobody said nothing. Soon, the only time motherfuckers started saying something is when that Cat Williams video did 73 million views and Shannon got up there and told Vlad that I made more money off that one video than I did my whole year playing NFL football. But Cat told him this was going to happen. Exactly. And that's my point. Nigga, they said Cat was gay. Nigga, they said Usher was gay. They said Usher was fucking hoes with herpes. They said Mike Vick, they said Mike Vick was passing out herpes in the lung. What, what, what are we going to stop it? I ain't saying nothing. I ain't seen nobody say nothing about none of this shit. Nobody. On this platform anyway. Let's go down the list of every nigga in Atlanta right now. Because I want y'all to stand on that same shit when we talk about anybody. It's just that Shannon Shaw became successful. Hell, I hope that Shannon come get us to be on his shit when he leads the volume. I'm saying that to the camera. Because Shannon and I ain't talking that shit like these niggas. Cause I know what's what's gonna happen if you come get this shit. I know this shit gonna go up. Cause cause these other motherfuckers, we gonna keep it down. But Greg know what I'm talking about. Why he looking crazy? But but <laughs> but that's my whole point. We don't do this with nobody else. But when a nigga gets successful, man, Shannon Sharp is cooking. That nigga did it. Let me tell you something, bro. That nigga did. Vlad got mad about Marlon Wayans not doing his platform. Right. And I want to make this shit crystal clear. Vlad got way more subscribers than Shannon Sharp Club Shay Shay. But this is how the algorithm works. Vlad got 6 million subscribers or whatever. Breakfast Club got 6 million subscribers. Marlon Wayans did Breakfast Club. That shit got 300,000 views. Shannon got 3.6 million on Club Shay Shay. Marlon, I'm making it to a point. Marlon did Club Shay Shay. That shit did 4 million in a day. These motherfuckers mad at Shannon, bro. Shannon Sharp did Lavelle fucking Crawford. A little boosted when he take a picture with this nigga and did like five million views. Oh, Lavelle yeah. Crawford. A little boosted didn't even know who the fuck this nigga was. These niggas mad at Shannon. So guess what they do when you start getting money? You gay? Richard Pryor, gay. Eddie Murphy, gay. M Martin Lawrence, gay. Will Smith, gay. Diddy, gay. Jay-Z, gay. Look on the list of all these niggas. Every single one of them. So y'all telling me all my heroes, gay as a motherfucker. That's what, what y'all telling me. Man, come on, man. We got to stop this shit. As soon as the nigga gets some money, they gay. So y'all might as well get ready for that shit when bad speakers blow because all of us gay too. Man, 
Or I'm in the Illuminati, or and I'm all you know I don't believe somebody. that shit. Y'all stop that Illuminati shit too, because you just don't work hard enough. That's all it is. Your ass don't work hard enough. That's it. Motherfucker get paid, get money, and they blow up, and your ass end up there, goddamn doing whatever the fuck you doing. That's what that like like that's just what it is, bro. Niggas, niggas, niggas sit up and find a reason to figure out, man. Nigga, gay. That's why he made it. Did this and that. Harvey Weinstein doing 23 years behind raping black women and all and white women in Hollywood, bro. That's what, it, and, and, and that's the Illuminati. Yeah, somebody did that to Ivan. No, nah, nah, that, nah, that's Joel nah. Epstein. Oh, that Epstein. That's Epstein. But I'm talking about Harvey Weinstein who made movie, movie, Miramax, um, before the producer. movie started saying Miramax and shit, that's yeah. his shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, like, like that's what we do, man. And then, and then now it's getting to us. Like, now it's getting to us. Like, now anybody who blow up, and all, and all I'm saying is just make it make sense. It's, it's the only thing I'm arguing. I'm not saying nothing you saying wrong, but just make it make sense. How come? Please, before that Cat Williams interview, nobody had nothing to say. Nobody. Cause wasn't no dirt out there on him. Wasn't nobody trying to put no dirt on him. No. Somebody obviously was trying to put trying to put put dirt on him. The man, man been getting means for a long time. No, it I'm saying. Until, no, I'm not, let, me, let me be more specific. Let me be way more specific. It wasn't until Mike Epps got up there and did that joke on stage and say Club Shay Shay be gay gay. Look, gay gay. And after that, it started rolling. That's a fact. After that, it started rolling. And how did Cat Williams call it out? He said they go they gonna come at you as soon as that. As soon as this shit happens, now you're gonna go to another stratosphere. Guess now. what? You know what we need to do then? Come on now. We need to go down that 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 same that's the rabbit hole. No, we don't you said start with Mike watch, Elf. I don't watch I don't You said start with Mike Elf. Mm-hmm. Okay, we need to ask him what was his problem with what was his problem with, um, that he needed to Mike Epps already done apologized. He said he said he, he, he had everybody on the head. Yeah, he said he already apologized and met and made up and everything, bro. So Mike Epps said he was wrong. He said he didn't know Shannon with that shit. He, he, he should have made the apology just as loud as the gay gay. No, it's just that it's to me, it's two things happening. Shannon shouldn't have took it that hard because he's a fucking comedian. Look, bro, I don't look, I, I tell y'all all the time, but I'll keep it real. Shannon shouldn't took it, he's a fucking comedian. Roll let that shit roll off your back. It is what it is. He's doing stage doing a fucking comedy show. Mm-hmm. You felt the way about that shit. You know what I'm saying? And nutted the fuck up. Which if a nigga calling me gay, I may well do the same fucking thing. Yeah, I just said it earlier. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Anybody, but but but, but, but y'all been yeah. arguing that the reason he's the he fired the nigga, now it make you look more gay. So like Cup said, we you can't win either way. Win. Y'all just was arguing this shit. But he fired a nigga, that why the nigga gay. Then, but then at the same time, you sound up agreeing with me saying that, oh, I would have did the same thing if a nigga called him gay. Which way do he need to go then? Just shut the fuck up. That's what y'all just said. Why? Well, me personally, I would just never hire. See, that's the media making you think that, hey, Jim, Nick, no matter what a nigga do, he can't win. He can't win. No matter what a nigga do, he can't win. I, I'm gonna tell you, man. That just, like, like, bro, which way he can't not win, bro? It, like, no, it really don't even matter. Cause it ain't gonna make me shit or, or piss either way. He can keep that motherfucker. We, 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 or he, we, he can fire that motherfucker. But in my opinion, I would never even hire the motherfucker. But since you did hire the motherfucker, and since you supposed to be so secure in your sexuality and whoever the fuck you are, because that's what they all, that's what they're going to say. That's another mind fuck, too. That, 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 yeah, that's what they're going to say. Yeah. You fired the nigga. So either you're saying, yes, I am gay, and I don't want y'all to know I'm embarrassed, or you like, shit, I can't let y'all be calling me gay, and I know I ain't motherfucking gay. I get fucked this nigga. I get my bit, the old bit back. And now that I believe that could be the, we got to realize it could be more than one logic. That's all I'm saying. Yeah, because, I'm saying because if y'all, if y'all pick at me, can be right at the same time to uh, to something. That's true too. Like I, I'm yeah. not saying there. You're right. He can't win for losing because it ain't no right way to do it because it's all gonna go off emotion. Because yeah. if I hire somebody, typically men. This this I'm just saying y'all tell me if I'm wrong. Typically men hire who's best to do the job. Only job we hire a woman for. To do the job, it, 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 she got to look good. Some secretary shit, some House. some housekeeping, some human resource shit. But typically, men hire the person who's best to do right. the job. You don't know that nigga been dressing motherfuckers in Hollywood. His name is Hollywood. His, his, he he pays the nigga one hundred and fifty. Let's get some facts out of the way. One hundred fifty thousand dollars a year to dress him. He's been dressing motherfuckers since by all type of motherfuckers. This ain't just no new shit that he been. He been this. This ain't no stylist. He just hired just off the street. The nigga nickname on Instagram is Hollywood. Guess what you just did? He been up. Guess what you just did? You just mm-hmm. proved my point. That just show how weak minded Unk is. Then he what? let he let the internet dictate him. Got them fired. A, a hundred thousand dollar nigga. He did. And I agree with you on that. I agree with you. But I can't get mad at me because but, Unk weak minded. But this, but, this, but this go back to what I just said. If y'all picking at me about that shit too, and I know I ain't, I'm gonna feel away. I mean, I gotta go. Let you go. Shit. I ain't even gonna cap, bro. These folks out here calling me this and calling me that, bro. If, and, and, or if it was my brother. If, if, I ain't gonna lie, I know how I am with the brother. Man, why you still got a nigga around you, bro? 
man, what the fuck you doing? Like, boy, you need to go, but them folks on your ass on the internet, boy, you need to go, but, but Zaybo, Zaybo, what we doing now? For real, but don't tell me, boy, you like that. Nigga, yeah. yeah what we talking about, man? When, 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 when them folks were going over there, chilling over there, got down, found, uh, over there on Murray Street long time ago, nigga, we don't think we had that conversation. I'm coming from a place right now. Yeah. Yeah, but that's what I'm saying. So, but, so, so don't. But guess what? It guess we stop doing. Stop going over. Yeah. There. Okay. So, so that's what Aunt just did. You gotta go. Uh, okay. Well, well, congratulations, Aunt. Like, <laughs> well, that's what I'm saying. Like, I, it, I wait. It don't make because I would never put myself in that situation. You feel like it's. You feel like. You feel like. You just ain't gonna hire nobody gay at all. No, I'm not. I'm not saying that. But it does certain shit that I don't feel like you need to help me with. Well, I can agree with you on that part. <laughs> but you can't, you can't That's discriminate. Right. You can't discriminate. I ain't going to hire no dude to drive me. I ain't going to hire no bitch to protect me. That's I'm not right. going to get no whole bunch of security to add bitch. You hoes at Columbiana. <laughs> so what the fuck? Come on, bro. Like, y'all, y'all want to, wait, wait. Since y'all want to, because y'all want to overly make me look homophobic. I'm, I'm, no, I'm, I'm, I'm phobic of all this shit out here, because this shit all fucked up out here. Yeah, what? Can't, no security. Bro, can't no, can't no bitch secure me at all. I feel you on that. I bet can't do never get me in a bigger problem. I feel you on that though. I feel you on that. I I, I can see that. True. I can see that. Nah, no, I ain't had no girl. That's why that nigga can't pick my pants out. Cause that, cause that hoe can't pick my gun. That's the reason, right though. Yeah. That's the reason why that hoe can't pick my pants. I I I I, I think it, you. I mean, I mean, you made some good points. Everybody made some good points. I just I just you, think. No, let, let's imagine this. We're talking about uh, security now. Uh, big brolic ass. Okay, okay. He's saying that the game. What the goddamn motherfucker look like goddamn Chris Cyborg, the bitch from UFC. <laughs> yeah. He's sitting right beside him. Are you intimidated? You gonna say, why well, do all goddamn bitch protecting him? That's what the first thing gonna come out your yeah, mouth. That's true. Why does he have a hoe protecting him? Hey, so why is why is niggas no, mad when we say, why shit. do he got this thing <laughs> dressed up? I'm running through that shit. I ain't gonna lie she to might you. Know something. Not saying she don't. She might be very good at her because she is a UFC fighter. It's probably a lot of niggas seeking knockout. But it ain't going to take away from the fact that you're still going to say, what the fuck is aunt doing with this whole goddamn protecting him? No, I agree with you on that. My whole point is, though, we need to confirm on our stars, man. That's all. Ain't got, no, you, you don't need to confirm. confirm. No, that, that's the problem. We were, Why are we even worried about who they fucking? Shit, you the one said the man fight. No, y'all asked me a question. You would never know how I felt if you would have never asked. <laughs> I ain't say shit, but give you an answer. I didn't jump out the window and say, man, I think that nigga ought by. I didn't lead off with that. We were asking you the question. You kind of did lead off like that. No, I'm saying. But G I, led off the US second. Yeah. Oh, that, no, I'm saying, but it was a question asked. I okay. didn't just jump out here and just start talking. Man, I think that nigga ought by. Towards a woman. That, that no. man said that y'all seen the, the video on. Uh, yeah, that, that was sound? the. You, then you, you said, me, fuck that, man. Aunt Bobby. He got the gay assistant. Yeah, you went crazy. You got the way Yeah, well, fuck that. Nigga, you did. I didn't know that. I forgot all about that. Yeah. Well, guess what? Well, guess what? Okay, assistant. America. Hey, watch this. America, the skeet lie. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't think he did. I, I just stated facts. You, hey, man. You just don't think that fit Buddy's job. It's just that job. No, it's I, it, he can that, he can work, man. That nigga can work at KLC. He want to? I don't give a fuck. Aunt should have never got in that picture, man. You can't crop shit out, bro. What's what's the picture is taking? That's what's right there. Deal with nigga. You not gonna sit here and say like yo ass this thing. What Aunt doing? Nigga, nigga. See, you trying to take no, that? No, 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 no. Shut that up. Shut that up. Cause you want to take that on the road. You want to take that on the side. Cause you want to look good on that camera. I don't give a fuck what these motherfuckers think, nigga. I'm telling you how I really feel. Nigga, no, I looked at that shit and I said, "Aunt too big, we having that nigga dress." I'm not gonna confirm All I'm saying, all I'm saying is, if I got a stylist like that, we ain't sent. Listen, you can dress me, but you ain't going no, to a motherfucking what? basketball game. Guess what? Sit if that's what you chill. are, you're my stylist, and and we taking that picture, and you sitting right there beside me, nigga. I'm confident in myself. The first nigga say something about me being gay, pussy nigga, who? Nigga ain't shit gay about me. Nigga, 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 nigga pick my clothes out. Fuck, boy. So, like, so, he's, so, so he's supposed to be the bad about the internet. No, no, no. I ain't saying he's supposed to be. But the first nigga, set an example. The first, so the first comment. The first one. <laughs> set the example. I bet if them niggas don't understand. So, up, gotta go find out where this nigga stay at and all this shit. That's what you saying. Fuck all 
Celebrity. <laughs> see, look, y'all don't, fun. y'all don't like the answer to the shit. question. But see, but see, the question was fucked up in the first place. No, that wasn't the, the question. But that y'all was, went there. Okay, well, all right, all right. Well, fuck all of that. We're gonna erase all that. How do I feel about Unk having intercourse That's online? Right. That was the question. Hey, you yeah. and him went there. That's I started off. I, I'm just saying. I just said I thought it was. Well, at that point, I piggybacked off your off your downs. Okay, I agree with that. I piggybacked off great. But guess what? This is how I feel. Congratulations. I remember a few weeks ago, Sean asked me the question like. Now, like, if you didn't ask the question, you made a statement that was like, boy, if a nigga fucking a whole bunch of bitches, bitch called a nigga gay. Unk got caught slamming the girl online. And they still call and him. And y'all man. calling the man. Girls no, no, no. online nowadays is trying to make it seem like a nigga who's promiscuous and moving like a fucking man is gay now. Just That's what girls are doing. And now a nigga get caught fucking a bitch online, he gay still. He gay. Like we eat, we really eating up everything they putting out there. But if you really think, about so because I don't know who's weak minded, us or them. No, it's it's way more girls out here playing gay than than niggas actually out here gay. No, I'm just saying of the logic of what gay. they just yeah, getting but, the but, benefits. What I'm saying is the logic <laughs> of what's going on is like I feel like we damn weak minded. Like bro, like like come on, cuz like really, like that's all I'm saying. Look, man, we don't talk enough about that. Ski, I get your point. I ain't gonna oh, lie. I got you back. And, See, and, look, that's what I'm talking about right there. Oh, he want to have a oh, back. Nah, fuck that. Nah, can, 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 can get what? Oh, 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 been out with goddamn no. room. Get what? Said undisputed. What, what, what did I say? Oh, what, 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 what the first thing I said when Unk got down left undisputed? I said, I said, no, I said Skip fucked up. Skip from the committee. Like, I'm, you can't I'm, read, you can't I, I'm, I fucks with Unk, but I'm not going to ignore what I said. Get what, bro? One picture over. One, no, it ain't the one. I just, bro, I never thought. Bro, I just say the man. Okay, I said, what the fuck is all doing with that thing? What if they didn't come together though? Huh? What if they didn't come together? Like, man. like, what, what, what if that wasn't his style? But you had court seat too. This is what I'm telling it's you. It still would look wrong. The one. optics. And then what they say, the optics. Quavo sat beside Chris Brown at the goddamn. And then what that shit looked like? Two niggas scared to hit. <laughs> yeah, that's good. Okay. But, but, Look, see, see, but, but that's that's the picture I got but though. With my eye. But two weeks later came back, but he, Nigga he got this track. But later would have came out report. What the fuck got the arm and everything? We can't just go by the pick. And one pick, one pick. On by. No, I ain't say you uh, said that man. <laughs> <laughs> that man, man. You and Greg called that man gay. Me no, good. y'all on oh, oh, everybody. Wait a minute. <laughs> Hey, hey, y'all, you, y'all two call that man gay now. Hey man, no, I said, oh man, first thing I said, bye, call. We, can, we, you know, we what, confirmed what, what, what you he don't, he don't like smack he buzz before. Yeah, he yeah. smack. Look, 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 look. <laughs> he still think he getting towed up. Man, y'all is crazy. Hey man, I don't know what Unky, but I do know this. That shit didn't look right. That picture, cause he can't take that back. Like I, I, I can't unsee the picture, dude. So, so, so we see you sim beside somebody gay. You gave from that point on? No. You buy from that I, I, hello? This is how Uncle was saying. I'm not going to be, no. He, he was not. Oh, man, he was just like that. 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 See how the internet make y'all get mad. Nah, you ain't going to say that at all, gang. Nah, I'm just playing. But, nah, nigga. I mean. Uh, but that yeah. was my question. I just said, I said, what, what if the what if bro wasn't his styles and he just had court seats and that was his seat? But it was like they I, went elbow to elbow. That's what, when I saw the picture, it was like I just saw a picture of Uncle Cud. I seen a picture of Uncle Cud with a fucking caption, and then motherfuckers went deeper. That's and, what, and they that, fucked you up. Fuck, fuck me up, cuz. Nah, I can't take. I can't take you back. Just <laughs> <laughs> saying, fuck me up, cuz. <laughs> but like I said, though, like. Bro, I'm not. I ain't. I don't. I don't, honestly don't care. Aunt got way more money than me. Get what? He, he can do what the fuck he want to do. But I, I it, this shit just real, man. Like the shit looked it weird. And that's the first thing that came to a nigga mind. Ain't no nigga looked at that shit. And when they said that shit, and then like, what the fuck now, Aunt? They Niggas did that. Aunt probably looked at me like, what? Okay, they guess caught what? me down bad. I already right went down the rabbit hole. But you still, when you first saw the picture in the caption, you said, "No, what the hell, Aunt got going on?" But I didn't. You're think. not going to tell me you didn't say that. I didn't write them off though. I ain't say you wrote them off. But you can find it. Oh, oh, gay. No. That's it. But uh, uh, got the, the, little, the little bubble when I was doing it. You know the little mojo on your phone when you got your little picture? <laughs> the little, little mojo on your phone. Man, you know that. Hold on now. What's going on now? Hey, man. I, 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 man hey, we can, well, that was a good one. I ain't going to lie. What y'all want to get into, man? Y'all want to talk about football? Y'all want to talk about top rappers? Which one y'all want to do? Man, I ain't even watch no football this weekend. Oh, yeah, we talk about, y'all, oh, let's talk about this, man. Jay-Z confirmed to be the person picking the Super Bowl uh, halftime show for the past, since 
basically the Rock Nation took over, confirmed by uh I forgot by the name, but he's basically a part of the NFL or he works with the NFL or he works with Rock Nation, whatever. So He must got fired. Hmm. What made him just come out and say that? I guess somebody asked him about it. Uh reporters or something asked him about it. Uh y'all know y'all <clears throat> y'all know why he picked who he picked, man. You know he got a riff raff with Drake, man. Yeah, Jay Z and, and Drake, they got their little little riff raffs going on. It it makes sense. Throw it back in his face. But it wasn't Drake. What are you talking about? Like Drake no, no, wasn't. No, what on the, what, he, the question he just said, he said about Jay Z actually picked Kendrick to do the show. Oh, you say he, he could have he could have chosen Lil Wayne, like like the public is saying. It makes sense for Lil Wayne to do it. Um but of course, Jay Z, he's gonna give the professional answer and say, "Well, you know, Kendrick's that guy. He's been on. He's been doing this. He's been doing that. He de- he deserve it. Whatever you want to say." But I, I I just I I don't think Jay Z liked Drake. Jesse Collins took the time to respond to fans about Lil Wayne not being selected for the halftime show next year. He also spoke about how Jay Z has always made the right decisions when it comes to who's performing. While speaking of variety, so variety asked him. In an interview he released on Monday, Collins reacted to social media outrage over Kendrick Lamar being selected to perform instead of Lil Wayne. As we previously shared, Louise is New Orleans, whatever native to this and that. Collins said, Jay-Z has served as the executive producer for the Super Bowl halftime show, collaborating with Rock Nation for the past couple of years. He's He brought Lil Wayne to our attention, but he selected Kendrick Lamar instead. He's always made the right decision. Yes. Uh, I don't think that's it. I think I think Luane is just a terrible performer. We talking about the summer Super Bowl. I mean, it's a whole bunch of clips going out of Luane performing places, and he performed at WrestleMania when Jay Uso came out. I watched WrestleMania. It was horrible, completely just horrible. Like that's just the best way to put it. You can just type in Luane performances. It's just not good. We talking about the Super Bowl. I don't think I ever seen a bad Kendrick performance. Also, like I said, I don't think he got a riff raff against Drake or nothing like. Oh, I don't think that's the deciding factor. I know factor. why he ain't performing for real. It ain't, it ain't got nothing to do with no Drake. What? Shit, but Luane the whole goddamn game member. They're not gonna let that nigga perform. Snoop fucked that up for any other game member. Snoop got up there, Crip walked. Snoop, Snoop got up there with the flag on. Snoop got up there, threw them seeds up. Snoop got up there and smoked that good tree. No game banger is ever performing at the Super Bowl. Not no bit time. That shit dead. Snoop fucked that up. I mean, I don't, Snoop, Snoop was a feature. No, that, that's a it fact. They told, they told Snoop beforehand, do not get up there with that blue on. Do not get up there smoking weed. Do not do anything associated with Crippin. And he did it. And what is Lil Wayne? The biggest blood. I, 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 I mean, mm. I'm not saying that's not a factor. I'm not. I'm not saying that matters. That. I don't think. But I, I think. I think with Lil Wayne, man, I just think that, I, like I said last week. First of all, man, we got to get the facts straight. But I don't think Drake. Is, look, if I got a beef with you, I'm not paying your taxes, bro. Fourteen yeah, million. Fourteen million. Because 14. of that gang shit. Don't yeah, fuck fourteen million. Is 14. City council. Cause the city council has shit to do with that yeah. shit too. And they probably said they said, man, that nigga hold up. We don't want that. Look, Nicki Minaj didn't give away no money. Drake didn't give away no money. Birdman Bird. didn't give him no money. Jay Z, a nigga outside of your whole camp, gave you fourteen million dollars. You think the Super Bowl or something Jay Z matter about? They only get paid for that shit. Show them. They only get paid for that shit. The only reason Nicki mad because she wanted to perform too. with Drake. The only reason Drake mad because it, he just don't want to hit not like us. Yes, and right. he slipped probably want to perform too. I'm, but Wayne even but Wayne he he slipped. Now, that's what I don't like about you, Weezy L, baby. Please say the baby. Nigga, you get your ass on the internet basically about to cry. Talking about, I, I didn't know. I just put myself in the position. And I thought, you know, I, if I would have got chosen, nobody would have performed with me anyway. I would have performed all the songs, even if they're wrong. That's like, I would have did it myself. Basically, what you saying, Jay, I wasn't even going to let that nigga perform, man. You could have let me got that shit. Man, fuck that, man. Fuck the Super Bowl, nigga. That's how you supposed to say it. I mean, I agree with that part, though. I mean, and I think, like I said last week, I don't think we held up our... Well, man, we did not hold Wayne up. And don't I mean, none Wayne of you niggas go bucking for Wayne to watch what y'all gonna do to me because I just said he was crying because he was crying. And don't get mad if you ain't help him pay them taxes. Shut your whole ass up. <laughs> All three of y'all. <laughs> All three of y'all. <laughs> yeah, but yeah, we didn't hold Wayne up, bro. The Super Bowl, they based that shit on who's performing on their numbers, on their critical acclaim, on what they've done, and what they've been doing lately. And I don't think we've been holding Wayne up like that. Like I said last week, 
week, man. Nigga didn't even sell out the Bro, tabernacle. Yeah. Who's pushing the fucking narrative? The only reason they care, if anybody, if Taylor Swift would have got it, these niggas wouldn't have said that. They only saying it because it's Kendrick and he and he, and he dissed they goofy ass. Yep. That's I just, only I just hate how hard Nicki Minaj is going. She, like, she a, going man, too she hard. She on them pucks, man. That motherfucker pucked out. Bro. She on the pucks. She on the pucks. <laughs> you let she on the motherfucker. <laughs> what? Man, Nicki Minaj, hey, she do good drugs, boy. God damn. <laughs> She, know no, she on some though. She she she, she on some. Yeah, she man, on some. She on the pucks. I, I know we ain't gonna interview her, so I'm gonna keep it real. She on. Yeah, no, wait, man, I'm not sure. Look, look, bro. Let me tell you something. I, I I hate that we gotta sit there and we gotta be nice and then. But but you listen to these motherfuckers in California. They talk talk all this out of town or shit. You hear these niggas in New York be like, son, they don't know nothing about her. Nigga, this shit been down here in Atlanta for how long, nigga? We we old hell, but this shit been down here since Ludacris them Ti. Since Pastor Troy, no, since Outcast, we've been running hip hop. But motherfucker would like to tell us what we can talk about and how we can talk about. It. Nigga, we we'll quit talking about Atlanta. I'm, I, I don't want to hear another motherfucker talk about their YSL trial. I don't want another motherfucker to fly here and interview Woody. Nigga, these are our goddamn snitches and motherfuckers, nigga. <laughs> don't fuck with our folks, nigga. We ain't talking about everybody going to go. This nigga said this is our snitches, man. Yeah, bro, this shit right in here. And then my motherfucker go do the interview with the other motherfucker. Magically, y'all get hit with Ricos, all types of shit, because they asking y'all all this police ass shit. But when you come to bad speaker, you get actually asked about what the fuck you supposed to be doing. Your music or your acting or whatever the fuck. But we're not trying to get police on you. These motherfuckers say they ain't trying to get police on you. But the whole time you're talking, you're talking yourself right into the jail cell. So come to bad speakers if you want to be free, niggas, goofy asses, from wherever you're from. Cause all of you doing police ass shit on the internet but us, nigga. I agree with that whole <laughs> yeah, yeah, round of applause, man. man. Oh, yeah, that that shit right be blowing right me, bro. These niggas be all sorts of, man, that's some police ass shit. But y'all stay running y'all asses over there to these other platforms. And then when they get you over to certain one, you, it might be a good platform, might get you on it, but they ain't going to ask you the right shit. They still trying to get police with you on the low. Mm. But it's that Vlad and goddamn um, Adam ass. They, they, they going to straight up ask you, hey, so you killed anybody this week? <laughs> like, bro, this, like, come on, bro. This shit weak as hell. Y'all take y'all goofy ass out there and then wonder why. Yeah, that's true, though. I agree with you. Shit, though, man. man, y'all niggas, man, y'all better focus on real nigga that trying to actually talk about what you supposed to be doing, nigga. Now, but one thing, though, get back to it. One thing about Super Bowl, man, and, and I ain't saying Wayne don't. Man, I just don't remember no monumental performances from him that was like, damn, he killed that shit. And I think, bro, you, man, go watch him come out at, 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 uh, at WrestleMania, bro. That shit was horrible. They showed him coming from the back too, like like the back where the gorilla position yeah. at. Man, that shit was horrible, bro. And they took a meme going around like, "This is what y'all want in the Super Bowl?" I'm, I swear to God. Like, I see, I seen that clip though. Man, that shit is horrible. And then it's not even just that; it's a couple more. I'm like, man, Wayne, don't really just be putting on no great show. Yeah, no man, Super Bowl is they get performers most of the time now. They get real. I think the last bad, I ain't say bad, but just wasn't a good, it wasn't as good as I thought. It, the weekend performance wasn't that good to me. You know what I'm saying? Like, it was okay, but it was mostly a set. I think it was during COVID during that time. I think it was 2020, if I ain't mistaken. But it, it was, you know what I'm saying? But they really typically get big performers. And like I said, man, we ain't hold up Wayne the way we supposed to, man. We don't, man, we, we just did. We didn't do Wayne. And this ain't me knocking Wayne. We just didn't do Wayne right. Then he said he can't. He don't, he don't even remember all his lyrics, though. He don't be remembering all his two, lyrics. He got so many songs. And Wayne is a rapper's rapper, bro. Like, he's a rapper's rapper. So it's like, how do we let that happen to him? Like Not even that. Why did like we, we we motherfuckers that going so deep into this shit. If Kendrick has a heart, he's gonna bring the nigga out. He's gonna let that nigga get it shine any fucking way. Yeah, like we over like motherfuckers is overly overdoing it. Like if Kendrick will bring that nigga out just, just because he know where the fuck he at. Man, yeah, yeah. He, he ain't gotta get the whole damn show. Yeah, By then I see somebody get, say that somebody say like you can't. How the hell are he gonna bring the gold out? I, was like, I, I said that online. I was like, but they probably do like Mona Lisa yeah, and Brain just to give you know what I'm saying recognition. But I, I don't know Wayne. If I Wayne shit, Wayne might just be like, fuck that shit. No shit, y'all didn't pick me. Ain't coming out. But let me ask you a question. By of course, you know Wayne is being loyal to Drake. Do you think he would even be willing to perform with Kendrick Lamar? Why the fuck? That's the real question. That? Man, hold on. Because think think about that. Because you know. Uh, it was like I remember a while ago. He had a he was he was singing "They Not Like Us," but he had the OVO. Yeah. He was like "They Not Like Us," like "They Not Like Me," Drake, Nicki. So it's like that's another question. Do you really think he gonna get on the stage with Kendrick, knowing that Drake ain't with that shit, and they all supposed to be together? But he what what, what he over Drake? 
He put Drake on. That's that's not that's Drake. Fuck that man, bitch, man. I, I, man, I'm getting up there. No, that, that is real. Okay, what? When they, they do, they not like us. Wayne, if I'm Wayne, I'm big blood walking all through that motherfucker. But I, I, I'm doing it. We, we doing it, boy. I, I doubt it. Wayne get up. I don't know, man. I, hey, if man, he do though, I mean, it, it, but he don't owe that nigga Drake. Since, since, since I was since, since I was on the list, Wayne might not be like Wayne. My man, fuck that. They could they could have picked me. Man, these niggas to help me pay my taxes. Man, fuck them niggas, bro. Ain't you fuck my bitch? Ain't you ain't help me? Fuck? Man, hold on now. Go to hell, goddamn Drizzy. Yeah. I'm, I'm finna come up there and sun your ass with this. I, nigga. There's no way in the hell I'm holding loyalty to you, and you didn't hold no loyalty to, to me behind my back. Oh, no. I don't know. And couple, then this is a Super couple, Bowl. A couple of tweets and a few posts, that ain't loyalty. Why well, ain't you literally just say, boy, that shit did, but that business, boy. Yeah, that ain't no loyalty, man. Niggas be, nah, that ain't loyalty. You fuck my bitch while I'm locked up in my lowest point. And not even that. You folks know I can't fucking, do nothing? What then? Folks were fucking with Drake. When he was fucking with Wayne, like when he first came out, folk was like, but that's how you like hip hop. Like, man, this nigga, we really gonna listen to some rap music. So we're, we were gonna hear Drake. But the street wasn't fucking with Drake till he jumped on that goddamn Cold Word series with Gucci Man. That's what these niggas owe Wop, if anything. Mm. Who's the person Him and Gucci? Nicki. Don't act like Wop didn't put y'all in the street. Like, see, it always come back to a nigga from here, man. That's what I'm saying, man. <laughs> it always come back to a nigga from here, man. Yeah, I mean. Because we've been running it too long. Everybody sounds like us. Yeah, we can't act like Nicki won the So Icy Girl, man. Yeah, she was on that slum party. She was the So Girl, man. First feature I've heard Drake on, I, like, from, like, outside of Canada or the motherfuckers up there, I, I, for me, was Gucci Man Cold World Series. I forgot which one it was. Burr, 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 what was it? It Burr, Russia, Burr, Great... Burr. Great, Great Burton. 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 Yep. And, and goddamn. Um, I got the other one. Gucci America. Or something yep. Like Gucci that. America. Yep. Yeah, nigga. Yeah. Real archive, nigga. So y'all can't. Don't. Cause you know, no math half ass niggas get out there talking. <laughs> Son don't know about no damn. You don't got. <laughs> yeah, my crack <laughs> ran deep too, nigga. What the fuck? Yeah, that's the first time I heard it on, on that Gucci Man mixtape. That's I like that nigga. So anyway, but hey, man. I think I think Kendrick gonna bring him out. I think he is. I did this my personal opinion. Um, and I don't think he. I don't think. I don't think he owed Drake them nothing, man. Them folks, like I said, man, them, like Jay Z paid the man taxes. Like, there's no, they pay my taxes, man. Shit. The fuck? Million in taxes. Y'all niggas quit acting like Jay Z ain't just like look, we got it. Like nigga been doing a lot. Got Twenty One Savage ass from going across that water. Paid Lil Wayne taxes, like, but everybody he was doing the internet. Meal, probation oh, he or kept something. Kept McMill, got him out of jail. Like, what is we talking about? I always say that man, the best business man. He the Fuck, best business not, man. Not the best rapper. The only nigga you won't get that from me, but you'll get that bad business man. Yeah, the only nigga that need to be complaining that dang. That's it. The rest of y'all niggas shut the fuck up. Cause he done damn near helped your whole rec all y'all niggas record labels. Damn them. Or yeah. somebody on your record label, or somebody close to you. Kendrick, guess what? You got some bulk of the Jay Z nigga. Dr. Dre, he wrote goddamn it still DRE. Who who we wanna go to? Who else we wanna talk about? Victory for Puff Daddy, he wrote that shit too. Where, where we going? What y'all want to do now? Who, who, who you want to name? Jay Z Jay Z wrote still DRE. Still the whole song, even yeah, Snoop Dogg verse. Damn. Even Snoop Dogg's verse. I heard the reference track. Yes. Jay Z wrote the whole song. The song they came out to the Super Bowl, the Kendrick Pop Out Show, all that. Jay Z wrote that whole, not just the hook, the whole Dre's verse, Snoop verse, and the hook. Jay Z wrote Damn. all that shit. Yeah. So like, like, uh, like we got it, like. Like you say, you, I, I don't. I still, I still personally think Tupac the greatest rapper. We gotta put some respect on the building, man. This nigga doing it, the shit he's doing for the culture and shit like. Oh, that. he he hands down no one being a man in rap. Man. He do like the only nigga that need to be mad is probably Dame. That's it. That's the only person could be mad. Who no two then? Huh? Been a man in hip hop. Fifty. Nah, if we being honest, we had to say Diddy. Yeah. Oh, okay. If we yeah, being yeah. honest, we probably had to say Diddy. Best business move in hip hop, I would say, when Dr. Dre sold them beats to Apple. Cause I thought that shit was like three billion, and he ended up leaving like eight hundred million or some shit. Hey, we can't leave that nigga with that big ass star on top of your head out of this shit either. That nigga with that big star on the top of your head. Business boy, man though. Shit, he like got he slim got right now. I don't know who pinky in the brain, but one of them pinky and one on the brain. They've been taking over the world for a long time too now. I, I don't know. He done re issues too. I mean, I, I I didn't say he doing good business with you. I'm saying he's doing good business. <laughs> I, I, I mean, I would say he's the I would say he's the greatest music hip hop music producer of all time. Executive like in in music of hip hop, who's better? Who who had the long around the bird man? Rockefeller over within five years. Cat No Limit over within about five years. Cab Money was well, Cab Money still going technically because Nicki and Drake. 
even if you say it's over with now, you got to add 13 years with Drake, 11 years with Nicki, about 20 some years with Wayne. What we talking about? But BG out, so it's still going. Right? I'm, I'm talking about like I'm talking about they run, run. Oh, you know what I'm okay. saying? Like if you if you say it was over in 2022. Shit, them boys had it from 2022, from about 98, 97, 98, yeah, to 2022. Bro, we, we just gonna go with the 99 and the 2000. Yeah. Yeah. About 20, oh, he's, you know, we he, listen to him. Birdman, I would give him that. He's probably the greatest record executive in hip hop history. You cannot take it away from him. Bad, bad Boy was over in about five, six years, probably. Yeah, that shit didn't last. But about five, six years. Bad Rockefeller didn't last old. long either. Rockefeller was what, what, 96 to about 2003? Yeah. Yeah. Whatever the the last was it Bad Boys movie they did a soundtrack for what movie yeah. All About the Benjamin it was one of them two movies yeah that La 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 song on yeah. Bad Boys the second Bad Boys too yep yeah that but they when died they died, died on that that's yeah death. that shit was over Birdman yeah I get Birdman that you know what I'm saying shout out to Birdman man Dude, you know that So Icy Entertainment came in and took this shit over give me two hey man let's talk about uh uh the indictments came in yesterday Leonard's on PB Longway I think he was arrested in Columbus Georgia but they called that boy with the world they call I see why they call him MPA boy money pounds and ammunition boy he had it boy like I don't know if he y'all nigga need to stop coming through Columbus Noonan stop coming through them cities man no I don't think they call him like that I don't think they call him like that I think that, no, that, that, that it was, was a fair they always pulling over somebody no that was a fair oh, investigation well, I, they, I, I think been, he was snitched on with that had, situation though yeah they had, they had been looking at him I think for like yeah, years or something like that they were saying well I haven't actually seen his name be as arrested I seen some other names on there but he, I didn't see he was definitely arrested no I, I know I'm saying I didn't see his name included in the Rico Oh, I don't know about Rico. Bro. That's what I'm saying. Like, you, you know, once you if you get arrested, they got 72 hours they can hold you. So if he's not out of jail by Tuesday or Wednesday, then yo, we need to figure out what's going on. But unless he's telling, ain't what? what? Unless he's telling. Well, never that. Boy, that's <laughs> I'm just saying. Yeah. 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 You know what? Yeah. You know what I'm mad about? It's just, it's just jokes, guys. It's but just he, he jokes. Never, that never happen. But it's just jokes. What, guys. You know what I'm so hurt about? What's up? Before my nigga Rich Homie died, I'm sitting on her campaigning by long way and corn the whole time. Me and you both say, what that Rich Homie corn run? That was a hell of a run. Like, nigga, I, I was emphatic about that shit. And I was so disgusted how low y'all had my boy Long Way, Long Way, all blue on his head. Down the, come on, like. And now y'all trying to take the take these niggas away. Y'all take Long Way away, but it's it's a, it's up. Shit, we gonna ride. Boy. They caught that nigga with the world. Yeah, we talking about really who like who. I remember they was talking about them in Atlanta, them 2010 years. They, you know, they were talking about when everybody missed them 2010. To like 15? Th- th- yeah, that run of Atlanta with, with run Jose around the Guapo. Lobby? We talking about who gave Atlanta the sauce that, that niggas that. didn't really know. Goddamn long way now. Everybody running around that lobby and shit now. Like, Travis Scott was in that motherfucker. And everybody everybody. Was dabbing. Everybody would dab all that shit, all that words and shit they were using back then. All it came from down. If, if you knew, you knew. Came from goddamn long way now. Like, like things in the scene, man. Just things in the scene. Man, no yeah. <laughs> but, what? Just things in the scene. <laughs> like I told him. Blue like, Eminem. We, that mistake was so hard. Though. Yeah, man. Like, like, and I think, man, they caught him a lot of shit. I hope he don't. Man, I hope he's. Ha- I don't know. But that boy, that's that a lot nigga. of shit. Bro. They said like two hundred and fifty. And that man and had a million, like quarter million worth well, of drugs. Worth a, worth a drug. Uh, I said, what y'all think? Y'all think he was getting off? Of, y'all think he was getting all them diamonds and grills and shit off goddamn records? Hell yeah, no. I, I don't think that was Hell it. Hell no. I, Hell I mean, no. y'all was supposed to say. I don't think that. No. Allegedly, I don't think that shit was it. Th- <laughs> my nigga made great, great, <laughs> makes great music. He made great music. Man, God, y'all better free cut. Oh God, bro, that shit gonna be lame as hell, bro. Like y'all don't understand. Was we a, already was got a hundred and one niggas arrested. Yeah, I'm shit like that. That's a lot of niggas. I, just, I, ain't watch, I just seen Long Way. I like, damn. That's all I left for that. I sent it to y'all, I think. Now, look, I, right all before right. you had said it, well, I seen that shit. I'm like, hold on. I'm scrolling. You no, know, I'm scrolling the tube. Well, I'm like, hold on. Man, this shit's got to be a lot. Jeez. You see that shit? I said, hold on now. What the fuck? Then I started seeing all those, all that shit. I said, God damn. Long Way. I hope yeah, he, he have no up. fingerprints on that yeah, shit. Yeah, he boy. fucked up, bro. He, he, he shot out Long Way, man. Hope he get out soon, man. What Did, did y'all catch any sports this weekend? Oh, no, 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 no. Well, nah, fuck them. them New York niggas. I don't want you to go in on niggas right now. Little TJ got arrested too. Now, see, I don't really know his sister, but I just know shit. They, they say it's, basically they trying to hit him with the same shit. Yeah, he got hit with Rico too. It's just like I feel like they just picking man. You know, they just throwing. They handing these Ricos out on because it's the easiest way to get everybody. What they pass a law about 
So, so what happened was back in the day, the mob used to get away with everything. The mob used to get away with because they couldn't get the big dog because therefore wasn't no lock because the big dog would only send out motherfuckers to do shit. You see what I'm saying? Hey, did you go got them killed? Such such such. So back then, the law was only strict on did you do the crime. So if Skeet go kill somebody, I didn't do shit. Skeet would be get locked up if he did the crime. So they had to figure out a way to catch the people who was sending motherfuckers to do shit. The RICO charge. Mm. So that's the reason why they can lock up 101 motherfuckers at one time. Because if Skeet tell, if I tell Skeet to do something and he go do it, now I'm getting the RICO charge for sending Skeet to go do it. As long as you got activity. two or three more people that's, how that's gonna do it. And yeah, and, then, and if somebody ride with Skeet, they go to jail too. If this person, if I tell goddamn 30 motherfuckers, if I hand out dope to everybody, hey, you gonna sell this, you gonna sell this, whatever. I'm not saying that's how it works, but I'm just saying. And y'all go sell and y'all get caught. I'm going to jail because that's the RICO charge. You see what I'm saying? Or 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 or, or committing of violence, and I'm the one who's sending y'all motherfuckers out. That's how you got. Uh, well, they got John got it because of taxes, but it's a lot of motherfuckers they caught for RICO. Think about it. The police have to pull you up. If the police see all four of us in the car together, they have to pull us over. They don't give a damn what the reason is. They just see four four niggas. But I know. Somebody got a warrant or some drugs or something in that, that car. car. It's something in there I can I can take up out of that. Shit, you remember we was you little shot at my nigga Buck, but we police get behind that nigga. We taking our hats off. But man. you don't even wear a hat. But well, nah, don't ride me with no hat. Take your hat off, buddy. They be talking to that shit, but we take the hat off, nigga. Like that's how we used to be when we was, man. What pull you over that shit? But uh, I guess little TJ man, you know, free that nigga too. Free you free too, that man. Nigga too, man. You know what I'm saying? Them Rico, but they had them bitches out like goddamn. I don't give a fuck. But they had them Ricos out like goddamn cigarettes in jail, bro. <laughs> God damn. Uh, let's talk about this. Um, sports, man. Y'all catching any sports? How your teams do this week? W one and one. Still, uh, we won. Shout out to Colorado. Yeah, I did come back. Y'all come in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Who the yeah, Falcon one? No, I'm talking about the. I was like Kentucky. I mean, I mean, the dog. Really we played play Kentucky. Yeah, yeah. I was yeah, gonna say. I ain't even watch no NFL. I ain't gonna lie. I ain't watch no NFL. I watch. I watch college though. I caught. I seen that y'all seen Shador didn't shake buddy hand. Oh yeah, he didn't. I wouldn't say he didn't shake. The either. quarterback of Colorado State. Why he didn't shake oh, hand? Cause uh, he was on. He did like a little interview or something. And he was saying, "Let's see if all the Instagram followers gonna help them win." Basically throwing shots. Talking shit. Like they ain't. That's an Instagram school. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Like he was talking shit. Basically. Then the end of the game, they gonna try to shake him. He said, "Nah." Shador you talking? Yeah, nah, you, you were talking that shit, shit on yeah. the ground. He said, and then Buddy just hit it. He said, like, keep walking. Hey, yeah. Keep pushing. But they, they, they were trying to show nah, say that. Nah, I can't agree with that. Um, I'm, I'm, because if, you, if you're going to do that, then you should have stayed your ass on the field last week when y'all got y'all ass toe up. Uh, if you if you can't dish it, then don't goddamn act all like that when you what, win. What, what shit he was talking about? Oh, yeah, he looked like that. Last week, he, no nigga, he didn't talk no shit. If you losing the game, the quarterback's supposed to stand on the sideline and go out there and shake everybody's yeah. hand. You chose to go to the back when you got your ass beat. It was like two week. minutes left in the game. Yeah, with two minutes left in the game, you chose to go to the back. Like, that's anybody. I said the same. The, I'm not picking no side because y'all know I'm Colorado no to, the, to the end. Man. Same thing with Tom Brady to get his ass whooped. Said the same shit on this podcast with Tom Brady to get his ass whooped. He lost in the Super Bowl. He wanted to run to the back or he lost. In the play, y'all, you want to run to the back. No, when you 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 don't have no problem go out there shaking the loser quarterback hand when y'all get y'all ass, when y'all beating the fuck out somebody, take yeah. your ass back out there. That man was talking shit, he was willing enough to come up to you and shake your hand because hey, I was the one talking shit. He ain't like, like, like if, if I'm talking shit about G or whatever and I lose, I can do the respect. That, bro, you got it, bro. But it's supposed to be just sports. Anyway. It's supposed to be yeah. just sports. You didn't stay on the sideline, you got your ass beat last week. You got the fuck beat out. Y'all got y'all got rolled by Rinaldi, whatever his name is, acting like got nothing Patrick Mahomes. Yeah. Out there jumping around and shit, doing the Patrick shit. Beat the hell out y'all. Hell no. Nah. Go out there and shake hand, bro. Like, be, 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 be a sportsman and do what the fuck you be supposed to do. He be a professional. He, he said he thought it was the water boy. Man, shit. But see, next week, but see, when they, look, look, man. The same way Dion got to take that fire. He was talking about, so we was coming last year. We coming now. We coming. Same way he got to take that fire, then you got you got to sit up there in that same fire when you get your ass beat, which that's what Dion did every week. Hey, we got to do better. Should do the same thing. You, know, you know what? Another one of the problems is, man, when you're a superstar athlete and you had that child, and you, the child ain't going to live up to it. Now, it's certain second, second generation players that they daddy were good, but they just way better than they dad, like Patrick Sertain the second. Mm -hmm. His dad was fire as hell at cornerback down at Miami. But he's just a little bit better than his dad. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, but when your dad's prime time, there's no way to overcome that. Like, it, you, he's never going to be that good. Like, LeBron, 
Look what I'm about to say right here. Now one of them little fuckers he made gonna be as good as he was. <laughs> <laughs> no, they ain't, bro. I can't even. Ain't now one of them. I don't give a damn how, how many. I don't care that LeBron done got them finna go down there in Nevada because he done bought that damn team in Las Vegas and he gonna put Bernie right there. It still is not gonna matter. Yeah. He's never gonna be as that. Yeah. He's did too much. Now, 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 now I salute Colorado for winning convincingly. They, they, they defense. Uh, well, they, they defensive line. They had some. I think that they, they felt. The shit from last week, them not getting to the quarterback. They got some pressure. The offensive line held the fuck up. Hey, Seton looks like a player this week. Like, really like a player. He didn't allow shit. Mm-hmm. Should do it had time. They cooked. I ain't going to sit up and lie to you. They cooked. But I don't agree with that, not shaking the other quarterback hand. Yeah, I think you got to be better shit. sportsman shit. You got to be a better sportsman than that because you walked off the field a week before and about, so I ain't. And then your comment was, I ain't going to stick around for that. Say so basically he could at least shook the nigga hand and be like, I told you I wouldn't. No, I just think anybody, I just, I just think anybody who knows sports know that's what you're supposed to do. Yeah. Like who who don't think that? Yeah, you got shit, y'all. That's sports shit. Sure. Oh, End game. I know. Hey. He gonna come across the wrong player. He gonna get that guy. Hey, you know, the same way, the same way he was holding up that goddamn should do it all yeah. year last year. They start getting their ass blessed and, and less and less goddamn, bro. You gotta stay out there. What are we talking about? What what my boy name who got down knocked that nigga out in Boys State? Miles, nah, hold on. What a name? Play, you know, he played at Oregon, and they and they, and boys that stay at JP Oregon now, and that boys nigga stay. turned around and knocked that crowd. I mean, that white boy out. <laughs> talking about he pressed him. Oh, you talking about that? Oh, long time ago. Yeah, well, well somebody, oh gonna, somebody God. gonna, I remember that. Say, oh. Somebody gonna fuck around and punch the door ass man, like that. Come on, man. Nah, no, I mean, I agree with you, but I mean, it do happen in sports with niggas. Look, Garrett Blunt. That, that the nigga. Garrett Blunt. Cause he just think you gonna get drafted off of that shit. He stuck that nigga. Yeah, I wrote that shit. Yeah. yeah, come on, I be the whole time. Yeah, cause they thought that shit was gonna fuck with his draft. I mean, I mean, it do it do happen in sports where niggas don't shake niggas' hand after they get defeated. I mean, what you mean it do happen? A lot of shit happen. We see UFOs every day. No, just shit it, happens. It, no, no, I'm just saying, just like, just like, remember Isaiah Thomas? You know the whole shit between him not shaking Jordan's hand when they finally beat him, but let Isaiah tell it. He said, "Well, shit. I mean, when Bird don't beat us, or uh, whatever the case may be, we beat them. Shit, they walked off the fucking court. They ain't shake our hand. We just thought the shit was normal, goddamn. But I get what you're saying. You still got to show sportsmanship. Yeah, Isaiah didn't think it was normal. Like they, they look at man, they play 82 games. After a game, man, you mean tell me every team they played in eighty two games, which one you think happened more? They shook more people hands when they lost, or more people walked away. You knew that they shook more hands than they, when they I lost. Knew it I didn't know the tell all the old video when he walked every, down with his head like that. Yeah, like come on, you walk past Michael Jordan, you hold your head up. No, we can't make excuses for that type of shit, man. Nigga, of course shit happens. Like yeah. shit happens every day. It's all type of weird shit that nigga do. That don't mean that you're supposed to do it. Man, Yo, right? Yeah, like your kids is gonna get get to fight in school. Shit happens. But I'm not gonna sit there and say, well, shit, motherfucker, get to fight every day. Shit, you know, did, did you win? No, nigga, get your ass in this house, nigga. Give me that tablet, nigga. No, nigga, you can't have no cookies. Take your look. I want some kick his ass upstairs. Nigga, you're in that school fighting. No, nigga, you're not supposed to. You're supposed to be a sportsman. you walking around with big ass chains on. You got on a fucking Cuban link while you playing the fucking game of football, literally up under your jersey. Like, yes, nigga, if you lose, like, if you if the other quarterback who lost, he, he should have walked off. Do you you think, the one talking shit. Do you think it's something that his dad need to address as a coach? Like, I don't think he need to address need to shake people hands after the game. I don't think you need to address shit. I think that I think that one, if you undress your quarterback in front of the media, then guess what your quarterback gonna resent you. If he gonna if he is gonna address it, address it behind the scenes. You yeah. do not undress no player yeah. in front of the media, period. You just say, hey, I need to do better as a coach, but what you really thinking is behind the scenes that look at a motherfucker, you shake somebody goddamn hand when y'all goddamn lose. Mm-hmm. Cause what you say in front of somebody, I keep that same energy when you yeah. ain't when when, when when now your quarterback feel away. Well, Even though that's your daddy. Y'all seen them for was it Utah? Like the, the the two players on the same team got to fight? No, bro. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, I seen that shit. I don't know if it was recent, though. I did not see that, boy. Damn. Well, like, they were like, boy, them folk got a problem. No, it was like in Houston. I did not see that. It was Houston. What, what you what you think about that Georgia scale? Oh, man. See, we got a lot of injuries. You know what I'm saying? But that's why we got the off week. Yeah, so we come back and, and we're going to roll back. We're gonna, you know what I'm saying? We're going to do what we okay. got to do. But <laughs> with that being said, we still won. Yeah, not you two. We still won. In the, in oh, the, you said you're, you won. Like yeah. you won. I thought you said you're number one. See? No, no, no. We're number, number two. Number you know, two. It doesn't number matter. One, guess what? Texas. It's, Texas. It's supposed to be. But guess what? It doesn't matter. It's 12 slots in that playoff. Yeah, it's supposed to be. Number. Once it comes to crunch time, 
We're going to separate. Oh, we, the oh, men Georgia, from the boys. Yeah, the Georgia and it's going to be Texas, Georgia, uh, more than likely maybe Alabama, and Miami. Georgia might lose three and still get in. Yeah. Georgia literally. What did I tell y'all about that Miami hur- uh, hurricane? Well, them Kurt, them Kane playing. Cam I, 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 I ain't seen them. You I like still ain't seen them? But Cam, Cam ain't bullshit. Yeah, they been too many games on college day on yeah. Saturday. See, you ain't got to pick a team you like. <laughs> yeah, you got to pick a team. That's what I don't Saturday, I'll be out, bro. I ain't going to lie to you. <laughs> you can't games. watch every game. You just yeah, got to I watch game. Colorado because Colorado. You, See, I just watch yeah. the teams I like. And I like Miami. I like Georgia. And I like that dumb test. Yeah, and yeah, I, I want to see, and I want to see how Oklahoma looked in the SEC. <laughs> I, that, yeah. I had to see how that. Yeah, looked. see, that's the thing. So Georgia weird, played. I, I thought Kentucky was in the ACC. Georgia and Kentucky actually in the SEC, so they yeah. really ain't gonna lose. No, even if they would have lost that game, more than matter. Like, but, but them being the SEC, niggas, I feel like Kentucky ain't good. Kentucky always has a real wide, rounded team. They just you know. But they, they, in the they, SEC. they ain't never just sorry. Yeah. You're going to have games where teams are going to show up. It's football. Any given Sunday, anybody can lose. You know what I'm saying? I'm just saying, from what I've seen on both sides of the field, that first game, Georgia looked good. Man, Texas looked good, too. I ain't going to lie. I ain't seen Arch Miami. Manning, boy, that slang in that ball. Now, he's going to take uh, Ewers' spot. Jeez. Ewers may not even get that spot back. After what I, I seen, know, when, you when I seen Ewers get hurt, crazy. man, that motherfucker man. went crazy. Man. I said, oh, this Five nigga hell. I said, man, look at him, man. I said, oh, this nigga ain't bullshitting. Yeah, no, but he can run. That nigga run. And he faster. Uh, look, the speed gene must have skipped goddamn Peyton and Eli. No, you know his daddy was a wide receiver. But his daddy can run. I know he can. I don't say it must so, but so his daddy can run. Where, these two niggas can't. And then but but the, but my other but my uncles can throw and my daddy can run. Yeah, <laughs> he, got, he, he got, got both of them. Yeah, yeah. He he, he he. I was like, oh, that you was my, and you was is, is amazing now. Don't yeah. get twisted. But it's gonna be hard after that shit. No, you know what I think? It, no, you was. He it ain't that he's amazing. He's good because he was. He's good. Guess what? Amazing. He was doing this like they weren't going to lose with him in there in no, either. Won. They won. But you can see that little nigga got an extra. Uh, God. Yeah, he do. He's he's a gunslinger. Yeah, yeah. And he ain't scared to got. See, you know what? I told that's, that's you. I, I told like y'all before this season started. Tess. That's my problem with Shadur right there. Shadur was standing his ass back there. He ain't finna. Yeah, he, that, he, yeah, he hold the ball. That ball. nigga is not finna take off. Man, you ain't have to tell that boy nothing. That boy. That was hooking horns. Yeah, yeah, he did. I ain't gonna lie. Yeah, that's the only thing. That's the only problem I got with Shadur. He just hold the ball too long, man. That's that's really the. Only I, thing. And, I, and I hate that we didn't get down Manning against Georgia because he wanted to come be a dog. We, mm. we just, but we keep putting all these old ass car salesmen ass quarterbacks up there. <laughs> that nigga, that nigga, nigga said from. car salesman. Carson Beck, all right, though. He might, yeah, he, he, all right, bro, but he might want to You know, I, I, how, we, how we like our quarterbacks. We do, you right. Them you know. worth a goddamn um, he, chronic motors. We, we gravitate towards the goddamn the, the. But we had DJ Shockley. That's the only nigga we don't have that, that, that goddamn quarterback position. But they don't want to put no nigga back there, boy. Yeah, I bet when George was when talking about nothing. Ain't no boy. You get a nigga at quarterback at George, he going to slay all them white hoes. Yeah, which I, uh, <laughs> uh, I'm going to tell you who ain't getting their job back. Uh, um, Florida coach. You know, Russell Wilson. <laughs> Facts. Boy, yeah, you know, it's old with me. I mean, he ain't getting that job. Cause get what? They finna go beat goddamn. They just beat the Broncos. They got one more. They gonna beat the next team. Hold on, they gonna go three and up. Can I? Can I give y'all some breaking news? What? Two minutes. Diddy reportedly taken into federal custody in New York. Um, according to TMZ, Diddy was taken into federal custody in New York Monday night in connection with the ongoing criminal investigation in. Uh, into alleged uh, sex trafficking and other offenses. Diddy's attorneys, Mark, I don't know how to say the nigga name. What is it? That's Something. Nigga named Mark. We're disappointed with the decision to pursue that we uh, believe in an I unjust that, prosecution of Mr. Combs by the U.S. Attorney's Office. He is an imperfect person, but um, is not a criminal. To his credit, Mr. Combs has been nothing but cooperative with the investigation, has voluntarily relocated to New York. Um, last week in anticipation of the charges. So yeah. he has been taken into custody as of now. But he went back to New York. Like I, I seen him in G-Dep hood because G-Dep J got out. Yeah, I, saw but that. I, I say that. It has just been it. showing his face like motherfuckers just no, going to get about no some choice. shit. Guess what? He's been out. You, been sell, out. you settling all them lawsuits. They feel like your money getting low enough. So they can go ahead and got them put that pressure That's on how I was just going to say. They, 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 they ain't think about that. Well, yeah, they been trying to wait for you to spend all your money. Your money getting low. And, and stop the other sources of income. Like, so you don't got the alcohol yeah. shit no more. You ain't got all, the, you don't have, you're not generating money. You're just holding on to money and mm-hmm. some assets. But now you keep having to sell a $100 million lawsuit. 
Who the fuck gonna represent your ass? He knew that he knew the charges was coming. That's why he tried to sell the house. Like I, I, I said this a long time ago. Y'all think these niggas got billion dollars worth of liquid lying around? They don't. When you go to pay them lawyers, you gotta have that motherfucking money. You're only as good in court as the lawyers that you get. Plain and simple. And guess what? They wanted him to they they wanted him to drain most of his fucking bank account, most of his money. So when they bring his ass in, there's no these you charges can't, gonna can't stick. You can't pay for that great defense. Yeah, you can't pay for that so, great defense. Yeah. Oh, now that's the Fed case. 97% percent conviction rate. You see Russell Simmons ain't brought his ass back. He was like, shit, fuck that. Yeah. I got the so game. so <laughs> like 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 it's gonna be but see, conviction and plea is two different things. A lot of people get that shit a little mm-hmm. bit confused. I we gonna see what happens with yeah. Diddy. You know what I'm saying? Um, but everything gonna come out now. Oh yeah. It been hit the fan now. Everything's gonna come out. Every single nasty ass, spitting on bitches, pouring lick up they booty, everything gonna come out now. Licking toes, they finna put every, every court date with that girl name. I ain't a lawyer, but this is what happened today. Everything finna come out. They finna now. hit the fan now. Like, like he so, finna have him a R. Kelly. R. Kelly situation, man. Like you see, they had, make this surviving Diddy. They are, oh yeah, they already got that on. Yeah. They, they got the special ready. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it's on. Fifty, 50, 50 cents for that for field day with this shit. Like, man. why him and Fifty don't like each other? Cause he Fifty, 50 said he never liked him from the get go. He wrote a. Make this money, take this money. That what he said he wrote for. Yeah, he, yeah. They, they, they said ever since he met him that day, he never liked him. He said he knew something was up or whatever. So I, I don't know, man. I don't know but I, I do know he had Diddy. Diddy had his baby mama, and Diddy was fucking his baby mama too. So, so he, baby mama. Yeah, he definitely so, wasn't that. Man. That's always gonna be a problem. See how I said. See how see it. It sounded street at first. Then it sounded like. He said, I don't like that. <laughs> and I had to slide that in there to you right there. Pumped it up. Yeah. You know, he's funny the baby mama, man. Like, yeah. uh, uh, man, look, man. Man, man 50 can't understand how that fruity nigga hit his hoe. Five minutes, they winning right now? About two. What? What quarter? What quarter? I can't even. Third? Mm. Who are they playing against? Eagles. 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 Oh, okay. Hey, man. Shit. I'm counting the dirty boys out, man. I'm going to ask y'all a question. Go ahead, talk to him. Cause. So, okay, let's say y'all start, you know, entertaining a young lady, right? Mm-hmm. And then you find out, you know, who her people is. You know how you be, you know, vetting the woman and everything. Then you find out, Man, you done fucked her sister. Mm-hmm. She don't know, though. So should you tell her? Or would you tell her? On or, or would you let her find out? Depending on what you're trying to have with her. If you're trying to be with her, you better tell her. Or... Okay. Talk to him. You play stupid too, nigga. You don't know. I'm getting on draw, nigga. <laughs> like, I don't know what you're trying to be with him. Hey, I, got, I got to agree with him. It's, 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 no, he's supposed to still him. try to hit regardless. No, I say it played. Depending yeah, on what you're trying to be with so him. When, but when would you tell him? After I done After hit. I fuck. Of course. <laughs> That's a fuck. I'm just yeah. saying, like, he was like, depending on what you're trying to be with him, you know what I'm saying? That was the worst question you ever asked. <laughs> yeah, you you got to get me. You the one, Mister. I got the fuck. Like, I know. I'm just asking. Though. I'm just trying to get there. You know. Are you trying to see where I'm around? Uh, no, hold on. Where I? Uh, what it called? I'm around. Oh, uh, yo. Shit. Like Low. date one. Be like, man. By the way, I do want to let you know. So, no. Nah, I'm gonna tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna play it all like I didn't know the whole time. When they finally hit the fan, be like, that's your sister. Man, I knew y'all looked the light. <laughs> I knew y'all looked the light. I ain't know what I'm saying. I'm getting red, bro. I'm like, oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> but but oh, shit. just just to just throw low and let out, she clearly named. She was like, you her know, sister. Boy, you know, you know her. She graduated with you. I'm like, yeah. Oh, oh shit. See, that see now, you, see now, now, okay. now, now you, you go change. Gus, now, you still got to try to, hey man. Hey, we don't we don't flip sides on the field now. You know what I'm saying? She clearly named. She was like, you know, I I said betting, and you find. Yeah, what? She shouldn't have asked you that. She should have asked her sister. Does she know you? That's a good point too. Yeah. Why? Why are you gonna tell her? You you want to hear her too? Shit, I'm not gonna tell you. I want to fuck. I want to fuck both of y'all. I don't. don't, Come on. If I I got an awesome chance to say I hit both of y'all, I know you need to go ask her how she fucked me. Facts. I agree with that. Uh. Trump assassination man, but they trying to knock that nigga ass off. Wow. Yeah, they, they dead serious about killing Trump. Man. Like they trying to knock this nigga ass off. I don't know if it's helping him. I don't know if it's not helping him. I think it's gonna hurt him. That's that's, that's well, two instances. Like 
God damn. Them folks that ain't, ain't got look, it, ain't, it ain't looking good for them. They yeah. don't want to leave it in the chance of the people vote at all. They want say, to. He trying to be the president or die trying. So, <laughs> hey, man. We might have our first woman president, man. Y'all think she won? Did, did y'all watch the debate? Oh, fuck that. Did y'all see the video I sent in that chat when I said, oh, come on, we're fine, boy. You're back in that head? Yeah, yeah. Uh-huh. Come y'all seen that? Y'all seen that? She was busting down you, the uh, man. The, the one you, oh, she was dancing and shit? Yeah. Girl, I seen that shit? Yeah. And, and she turned around and was like, are you his daughter? She was like, no. no. I said, God damn. Yeah, tomorrow was tough, you, you are a ravishing. She was tough. He said ravishing. <laughs> what? No, she was tough. Where you get that word? That nigga said ravishing. Wait, you, come on, boy. You been watching. That nigga been watching Bridgerton and shit, but That nigga said ravishing. She was tough. She was tough. You see that video? You gonna say the same thing? Did y'all did, uh, did y'all watch the debate or no? No, I didn't. Watch I watched it. clips of it. I watched it. But yeah. Other than not, man, I think we done covered most of everything with this week, man. Anybody got anything else? Uh, mm, let me see. Let me think. Who I want to talk shit about right now? I watched some boxing this weekend, man. Shout out to that boy Canelo, man. He still got damn knocking niggas out and shit. But, you know, hopefully the next fight is going to be between him and that boy Terrence Crawford. Kendrick Lamar. Excuse me, Terrence Crawford. I saw that shit. They said they thought that, <laughs> man. They call him. Kendrick Lamar, that was funny. Yeah, that shit. And then, uh, who that? Dana White, he had to apologize for that. He said, man, because what they came to the USC fight, right? Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. No, uh, what's his name? Uh, Dana White said he did look like Kendrick, though. I was like, that shit. I ain't going to lie. People were mad about him saying that shit. He basically saying all black people look alike. Them y'all, niggas do not look alike. They all, all white folks look alike to some of us, too, now. Huh? Should we be saying any white folks look alike, too? Yeah, that's y'all true. Y'all know y'all do. We just act like we don't. Mm-hmm. Hold on, boy. I'm showing my boy Cook got down y'all president, man. Hold on, play. Why you say y'all I came from here? Hey, man, I'm indigenous. I ain't no part of you y'all indigenous. government. You indigenous? Yeah, I'm not a part of y'all government. Oh, damn. Why that shit in me? Boy, when you, when you see her. Hold on. Okay, let me get it. Shout out to old Kamala Harris, man. Boy, why? Hold on. That, that was her right there, but you got to see the better picture. Like, let me see. Let me see. Uh, uh, like, I would like, like, cause he got a hole, boy. They talking about they had a hole, but what then? She, you ain't gonna push up on that. <laughs> damn! <laughs> I don't know if I'm gonna put the smoke in there. You gonna play it, you gonna play it, but like you ain't gonna jump down. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Look like a young guy down. Hey, like she came with me down back then, boy. So, so she was a young hot thot back in the day, man? Boy, boy I could tell, boy. Yeah, that, boy, that house swung around. Now, but Trump been shot at twice, man. Yeah, yeah, man. I, I he, think. He street, man. What happened when you and me got the political street? Trump say, hey, man. Follow up, fine. Like, God damn. Yeah, man. Shit, man. Man. Now, if we got to have a, a woman president, I'm glad it ain't Hillary. We got a fine look Kamala. Yeah, I think. I just say this real quick. I think Kamala won a debate. It was a clean sweep on the debate. It wasn't even a question. They mm-hmm. called Trump lying 33 times. Kamala only lied once. Like, he didn't really have an answer for nothing. To be honest with you, but that's what we expect from Trump. I don't think he even cares about the debate like that. I think he has to do the debate because PR wise, it looks good. Mm-hmm. If he don't do the debate, they're gonna look at him like he was scared of a female. Uh, problem was going on now is that Trump is the old man in the room now. Now you sixty eight, whatever the fuck age you is, and she's younger than you. So now you like the old C nine man now because you're not going against Biden. That's why you hollering. You know Biden should have stayed in the in the race, and I, I he did this net because you really wish he'll come back and, and debate you. So you because you, basically he's inferior to you because he's like the old nigga in the room. But now you like the idiot. Um, I don't know if Kamala gonna win, but I think she got a great chance to win. Mm. Um, problem is, like I say. <sighs> Is other countries gonna respect her as our president? Is, the, is what's gonna happen? <laughs> I know you didn't say that. That's something that yeah. Yeah, I think that's something that I didn't think about. Somebody brought to my um, uh, a dude who I worked with. He was in the army, and he was. I was telling him how I felt like you know she's the best choice. You know, um, Trump gonna get us killed and all this other shit. And you know, I talk a lot, but at the same time, I listen. He was like. The problem is, is that is other countries gonna respect her being a female? Say Western, you know, the the re, the Eastern Western world, whatever the fuck it is, they don't respect women and no, just and then, yeah, just, no, 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 you just, just but tell, you just I told you that though. everybody are saying nobody, don't nobody want no. It is be if we being real, don't nobody want no woman in power. I don't but, know about but that. I, I, I'm oh, saying, I'm, president. I'm saying, remember, I, I don't, you don't recall don't. me telling you, I was like, bro, it's it gonna be some country that she go to, she can't even speak. Well, just because they ain't, you know what I'm saying? Like that's how they 
laws is and well, shit. Well, like, well, it depends. If she's going over there as the leader, it's going to be established what she's coming over there for. I'm talking about like they not going to respect her being a woman. And, okay, so let's just say she's going to Dubai, right? They know that our president is coming over there to talk to their king or prince, whatever the fuck it is that they got over there, right? She's going to be allowed in that type of type of plat in that that type of like environment to, to say whatever she's but going if, to say. If she wasn't the president, but behind she the scenes when she leave, they just not going to respect. But not when she's yeah, they're not going to respect her as a female being in power of a country because over there they don't respect women in that aspect. Meaning that could put us in a lot of trouble when it comes to a woman being in power as a president. Only the reason I'm giving you pushback is I don't think the, I don't think us over here if she wins she wins. I ain't saying I'm just, I'm just uh, saying the rest of the world maybe but over here if she wins she wins. I don't think we I, I think we done became so far progressive that she can't she got a good chance of winning. Cuz she raised that much she couldn't win. I'm just saying like I just still think don't people don't respect a a, a woman in power like that. That's all I'm saying. But she definitely can win. If she wins the highest honor in our country. Fuck basketball, fuck football. We know what they make. Yeah. Fuck doctors, fuck all this shit. The highest rule of power in the United States, just factual, is a president, bro. People do respect a woman being in power. That's just what it is. If she wins both electoral college and, and popular vote, that statement don't make no sense, because obviously they do. But I do believe the rest of the world is going to look at her differently. I, well, I think we've been America's been pushing the narrative for so long of women equality, women this, women that, women this, women that. So yeah, now we're ready for a woman to be the president. Like we can mentally handle it, but see when it goes astrodyne, like I said, check this picture out. Do you want a woman bodyguard? I mean, no, I don't. That's basically what your present is, your bodyguard. It's fuck your present is gonna protect you from fuckers trying to come over. They can push the button. Are you are you cool with knowing that we got to depend on Kamala? Not saying it was going to be but, cool depending but, but, but on Trump I, either. I don't think the president... Nah, I got to get away. How many times Trump got caught lying, you said? 50 times? 33 in the little, times. The uh, night, yeah. I don't believe in none of these silly motherfuckers because I feel like all of them are public. It's somebody else that's telling them what to do. Like, if you watch that George yeah. Bush movie, you'll see... He, Dick Cheney was telling yeah, him. Yeah, like so. But, but listen, but don't the don't the general really make make the decisions? Like the 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 president is just the spokesman of everything, right? No. When it's come to making decisions, no, no. whoever the handler is. The, the, so I'm the president, the president got to push the button. So. Yeah, the president make the decision. The president makes the decision. But I'm saying certain, certain people have handlers. Certain look, who's to say she won't have a handler? The, 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 the true. She 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 probably will have somebody in her corner telling her. Dick Cheney told George Bush, like you said a minute ago, what to do. That's why they got a movie called What Is It Dick or Vice or somebody right there, where he's basically the most powerful vice president of all time. I, I encourage you to go watch it. Uh, but even though Cheney was telling George Bush what George, to do, George still, Bush had to say this is what we're gonna, gonna do. do. Yeah. It's just like in school, but they tell you the president is the commander in chief of the country. Period. If he give an order to the army, they have to go do it. All them drone strikes and shit was made from Barack Obama. Now Barack Obama, like Skeet say, may have what you call a handler or an advisor. Yeah. Somebody, or an advisor. Like this, this is what one you, person. Like yes, I, I'm gonna listen to what this motherfucker. Says. I ain't gonna listen with all y'all. I, I hear. I can hear what you're saying, but afterwards, so the general I, don't have no choice. Now mm. the president said, you, you, "Do you, you think, goddamn, what the motherfucker, the black nigga name was? That was the, the that was the uh, Colin Powell. Powell. But don't make no decision. He take orders from the president. None of the, the, the president is the commander in chief sure. of the United States of America. Plain and simple. The only branch they can sit up and overrule the president is the Supreme yeah. Court. That's yeah. it. And that's nine motherfuckers who've been elected by Donald Trump. That's it. The Supreme Court is the only branch to overrule the president. That's it. If they want it to." Most of the time, they don't. The president can come in as a president and make executive orders. Within the first 24 hours, he can sit up and make certain laws and shit like that pass as soon as he's elected president. So Donald Trump did it before about basically motherfuckers who, who like uh, oil companies can pull, war, can pull oil into the streets and shit like Some shit like that that he said it was okay for them to do. Certain bills and laws he passed in the first 24 hours. And when the president leaves, he can also give pardons to certain individuals who's up under federal Locked, locked up due to federal charges, not state charges. So that's the reason why he was able to let Kodak Black out, Lil Wayne out, and people like that. You know what I'm saying? He couldn't let Youngboy out because Youngboy had state charges at the time. So that's how it worked. But now, nah, man, it's going to be interesting. I think 
that's why Trump's in the debate. You actually think our um, people, you know, commanders and chiefs over. I forgot how you put it, but overseas, you know, powers that be is going to actually respect her as a president. I, he actually said that. I, I saw that. Yeah. So that's that's going to be interesting. Do I think she can win? though? I think she might win. Man, yeah. look at Taylor Swift just endorsed her. I just saw that. I just saw Man, that. Man, look at that shit finna go Caitlin through the roof. Caitlin Clark endorsed her. Caitlin Clark endorsed her. Oh, that, that made that boy Jason Woodlock, man. Beyonce yeah, but he did. couldn't speak on Yeah, it. Beyonce didn't perform, but she endorsed her. Mm -hmm. All the motherfucker Trump getting a bunch of niggas. Yeah. Not even that. Hey, hey y'all hey, pay attention to this? Like, you know what I heard. So, all right, I, I don't even just talk about this uh, election. Just growing up and knowing all of the presidents that we've been in, been alive for. Mm -hmm. All them motherfuckers suck. I agree. It ain't been one president that's been in there that you could just say like, "God damn it, that was the, that was our commander in chief, boy." We all these niggas suck. It don't matter who the fuck you put in that bitch. I, I, I don't. I think, I, think, I, think, I, think, I think Bill Clinton did okay other than his scandal. <laughs> no, he Bill Clinton Bill, Bill Clinton locked up more black man than motherfucking got than, than anybody in any presidential history. Remember now the the, the, the eighty the, what ninety four crack law that, see, was passed upon the Bill Clinton. Like the, I didn't go down these. Cup days, Daddy bro. did eleven years in jail because of Bill Clinton. Facts. Look it up. My brother did so many. Bill years Clinton. Bill, look at man, just because yeah. that nigga got on Arsenal Hall to play the saxophone and niggas sit up and fall behind that shit because he doing some black shit. Bill Clinton won shit. He won shit. His, his, you his, think he's the only nigga got some head in the Oval uh, And Bill Clinton won shit. He he did. He fucked us. He fucked us up to this day. That's the reason why most. De that's the reason why niggas like me and Skeet Daddy won there because because they, they gave. They be in the house. They, yeah, the Bill Clinton did, did that shit. They passing law for Ritland and shit and all that shit. Our kid, Alec, I don't even want to say your name, but yeah. our kids and shit were fucked up because of Bill fucking Clinton. I don't know where you got that from. That shit. The hell now. Nah, fuck Bill. We, we never had a good president. And Barack didn't pass shit for us either. Barack ain't passed that damn, damn law for black folks. Right now, they pass, he passed the Asian goddamn law for them not be the hate crime law for Asian oh, yeah, people and that. shit. He ain't passed not one law for us. Not one. Fuck all them niggas, man. I'm just being honest with you. And all this shit that they talk about, that they talking about they're going to pass uh, during that debate, then none of I get Trump get, that. I get Trump that. Trump will sit up and say some shit. Yeah. For, for, what for, you know what he woke up? Now, you see how we, everybody saying, oh, well, trying to bring Unk down. But why is everybody so much on the bandwagon for Kamala? They don't even know what the fuck she really stands for. Every nigga out there is just she going Kamala. Because she got the name Kamala. And Barack had Barack. Like, it, it, they go get the most goddamn African ass names they can find these motherfuckers. Oh, exotic ass name. Like, you don't know no other Kamala. But, well, the, but me, the Ugandan giant that he was on Russia. But let me, make sure, let me make sure you stand, though. You said that she's not a better pick than Trump. No, no, no. I'm saying I, I don't condone none of these motherfuckers. I yeah. don't think no president, uh, nobody that's going to get up there is for the, for our for us. Period. Because guess what? It. We're not going to donate no money to their campaign, no way. So they're not giving a fuck about the black vote for real. We just, you know, cause we need to be entertained. That's all they're doing is entertaining the niggas. Like they, it don't matter what we care or think about. Not that they say the right shit. Okay, so and we gotta get out of here. But I think I think they say the right shit for us because we move the culture when it comes to cool. Yeah, that's all. So we do. so so they gotta say certain shit for us to be. They like, need oh, us to be on yeah. their side. But I don't. But, but I actually just Tim Lake before one time. Then one of these. One, then one of these conventions. It's all niggas on both sides. Yeah. It, it, yeah. Mm -hmm. On both sides. Hmm. What I say? Entertainment. Uh, oh, yeah, you did. You did. Don't nobody true. know what the fuck she wants to do for America. Don't know that they don't know what the fuck she want to do for Black America. You don't know what now. What don't want to do for Black America. They just know how to entice y'all. And niggas just see somebody black and they go on to vote for. Them. That's it. That's the only reason they vote for. Her. Now me, I might vote for because I saw this YouTube video when she was young. So that might be oh, why I vote man. for it. But other than that, it ain't because I know what the fuck she stand for. It ain't because I don't give a fuck. Because it doesn't matter who's in office. I think I think people are now is just voting for like who you don't want to vote for. And then go from there. It, 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 yeah, I think... I, look, I'm not voting for Trump for the simple fact he got 31 goddamn uh, charges against himself. Uh, I'm not voting for <clears> Trump <throat> because he's been bankrupt six times in his whole life. I'm not voting for Trump because... Got damn a whole bunch of shit. He's made racist comments like, "Hey, we would we would have hung him back in our day." I'm not voting for Trump because he said on fucking tape, "Grab him by the pussy." And the reason why I'm not voting for Trump is because a lot of shit I just said, Kamala Harris ain't did none of it. 
to me, that makes you the better fucking candidate. That, that's what I'm saying. Just you factual. You, you, know re, you realize you don't want to vote for him, so yeah. So like, I gotta it, vote for her. Like, like until but she, she until she accomplishes some of those things or do some of those things, I can't sit up and say I'm just not. I, no, you can, but I'm not gonna sit up and just say that she's not the better candidate for between the two. I got to pick from. Oh, you don't no, get I'm not saying she ain't the better candidate. Yeah. I just, I just don't agree with no, no candidates ever. No, they all fucked up. Now. Like, like, they, they all fucked up. All good. Like I, I'm gonna be real. <laughs> And I know this don't, this don't matter because we're going to have a president regardless. But I feel like I'm so grown. I don't need nobody to tell me what the fucking do. Like, nigga, I don't care. Just keep the army there. Keep niggas from jumping over here, standing on they on that foreign business. And I'm straight, nigga. Well, that's going to happen. It's going to happen in our lifetime. I can, I can guarantee you. But somebody going to come over here and play with them? Man, I can they, guarantee they, they, you. Within they, the next, I, I can bet you in the next five years. Yeah, if they, get, if they take away all our somewhere. guns, it's going to be America taking over. Right? Because this is going to look like the Hunger Games out here. No, I think, I think somebody, bro, D, I'm thinking somebody going to push a button. And, and they going to give a fuck. They, they, they right there in Cuba. Man, they send that shit Russia over. is. They got Y'all they, better miss Noonan, nigga. <laughs> if they hit if they hit Atlanta right now. We ain't, got, we ain't got enough time to get out of get out of. So that I ain't now. got enough time to hit one one last. Well, you can't even goddamn. Well, it's over with. You don't take five minutes from Cuba for a missile to get here. Now if it's over there in goddamn South Korea, it's gonna take about a couple of hours. Man, I roll a blunt slow as hell too, boy. I ain't gonna never hit that. Shit. Yeah, man, we get out of here. This nigga man. talking about hitting a blunt. You about to be cranking that bitch up. We are bad speakers, speakers. TV, man. It is your boy Shad. It's cool, boy. G. It's your boy Cup, man. It's the new hater on the internet, myself. And did it just bail out? God, I just, 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 I just